here we are. Let's do our normal checks. Make sure this is all working. Good. Right, right, left, right, right, left, left, right, down, up, left. Ah, I gotta love that. Whoop! All right, that maxed it out. Let me double check my. Let me double check this. Okay, that's all good. Maybe just don't yell into the microphone next time. Alright, um, okay, so that sounds like it's all good. Uh, no, hold on. So, Joe Wood, hello, it's always good to see you. Alright, um, I'll explain in a second. I'll explain in a second because, uh, we, <sighs> we, weren't, suppo we weren't supposed to, we weren't supposed to switch. But we did, uh, because I'm a terrible, terrible person. Um, when the game starts, you have to tell me if you can hear well or not. I can't quite see. Bumbo, hello. There we go. Okay. So good to see you. All right. So, 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 so. I can't move my chair. <gasps> so. Let's begin. Hello everyone, my name is Max Olson Lecture. Welcome back to Not Tales of Arise. It's not Tales of Arise at all. So, um, full disclosure, I may or may not have gotten distracted this past weekend, um, playing Raft with my girlfriend and a bunch of my friends. And um I uh, I I didn't grind in um I, I didn't grind in Tales of Arise, okay? So, if we did Tales of Arise, today would either be dedicated to grinding, or today would be dedicated to uh, doing something else, playing more, more Resident Evil 7, playing more da-da-da. And I recognize that there's a lot of games that we have, I will say videos, that we have on backlog, right? Uh, with Elden Ring coming out, with wanting to do a Warhammer one-off, with wanting to play Mortal Shell... Uh, Legends of Arceus looks really dope. I would like to play that. Um, Brilliant Diamond was on that list. And we still want to finish Tales of Rise. And by finish, I mean get to the halfway point because we kind of decide with that game. Are we having fun with it? Yes, but we're not enjoying the game as it was intended to, so maybe not. So, in the meantime, I thought, hey, let's do Pokemon Brilliant Diamond, which I got for Christmas, which I'm very thankful for. So, what are we doing today, then? Right, there, there's time, but... um. There's time, but with three streams a week, or really, I shouldn't say three streams a week. I should say six streams every two weeks because that gives a more accurate representation. So that way I could say three streams of a game a week or every two, bi-weekly or however you want to say it. So, you know, time flies, right? So I thought let's start the next series and I just kind of move Pokemon a little earlier in because we're going to be doing, I don't, what do you want to call this? Like. A bug gym challenge, uh, just a bug challenge. Uh, I'm not very good at naming things. Speaking of, I'm not, I don't really know I'm going to name my character. So is that, as I'm laying, I'm lounging down here. Mono bug run, that, that works too. So, our goal, I've threatened this for a while, is to do a mono bug run. Uh, how, how will we do this? Pretty simple. Uh, I'm going to start with, um, I'm going to start with Turtwig. Because, um, I've never actually played... <sighs> okay, we played Soul Silver, which is Gen 4. And I've started a little bit of Platinum on my own, but I never actually sat down and played Diamond, Pearl, or Platinum. So playing Brilliant Diamond, I thought would be a good way to do so. And, um... I threatened... I also suck to think of stream tiles. <laughs> and I, I, I get that pain, man. <sighs> but, um... I've threatened and I've talked about doing this for a while because I did it once on my own in Pokemon Crystal, I want to say, and I had a good time with it. Like doing mo doing bugs was fun. So how we'll do this is um I'll have to get Turtwig, and then because of the um Gen Four starters, he is actually my favorite one. And um once we fill up with bugs or have the ability to fill up with bugs, we replace him. Simple as that. 
Uh, downside is though. Okay, so I did some. I did ten seconds of digging, and um. Okay, I'm gonna break the illusion just a little bit. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna break the illusion just a little bit because it occurred to me. Ah, oh, damn. I'm not gonna be able to see chat for a little bit. So, hold on, hold on, just a second. Let me display capture. There you go. Okay. So obviously this is small. You guys are seeing what I see now. So I'm not gonna be able to see your chat. I looked up a website of like, okay, what bugs can I get, right? Because I was like, ah, oh, is this is this where Wormbolt came in, or is this where something? I, I wasn't quite sure. And um, there's only one bug you can get naturally, and by naturally, the illusion has been broken. And by naturally, I mean um, from walking around in grass, and that's Cricketot. Cricketot fucking sucks. Like I just want that stayed for the record. Cricketot sucks. But Max, he's my favorite. God bless you. I hope he makes you happy. I hope you have a really good time with that bug. I really don't like this bug. And um, all these other bugs, Heracross. Heracross is the best. Um, they're all from trees. So this first stream might consist of us finding the nearest honey tree, buying honey like it's free, and hitting our heads against it in the desperate, desperate hopes. Okay, so we get a hair across, right? Good shit. Uh, we're going to have to get both sides of Wurmple. So Cascoon, Silicoon, that's a Beautifly and not Venomoth, uh, Dustox. Um, combi, we're going to need to get a female Combi. We're going to have Cricketot. Okay, so hold on. Okay, so, huh, 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 huh. Um, Burmy can turn into one of three things. Either uh, uh, Bug Grass, Bug Ground, or bug, bug Steel. And honestly, there's a good argument to get all three. And, um, yeah, Wurmple, ba, 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 ba. Everyone noticing a lot of repeats? Everyone noticing a lot of repeats? Um, I think, like, way later... Oh, no, 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 there was, um... Uh... Surskit. Oh, yeah, there's a uh, Pinsir and Scyther way later on. Uh... Skit, skit, skirt, skit, skit. These are all the underground ones, so they're all the national decks, so we're not going to worry about that. There's one spot that could get us an Inkata. So that's all right, I guess. Uh, sun, sun skirt, sun, sun, s sun skirt, skit skirt, the, 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 um, uh, <laughs> skit skirt. <laughs> I don't remember what it's called. Uh, the adorable little, like, water bug one. The, uh, ah, the void, sorry, but, um, the, the, the water bug one that evolves into a bug flying one. You'll notice the Pokemon that we're looking at, it's a lot of bug flying, a lot of bug flying. So, I mean, between where well, we're going to get Beautifly, we're going to have Vespa Queen, we're going to have, um, Cricketot. It's going to be a shit ton of bug flying. So it's going to be a little rough. But yes, our goal in general, just laying out the goal, right? This is not a Nuzlocke. If someone dies, it's okay. It's not the end of the world. We can cheese with revives. We can heal. We can do whatever we want. The rule is just you have to catch bugs. You have to catch bugs. You have to have bugs. Um, I Okay, I love Turtwig. I, in the world of... Um, I would like to learn Korean. No. Yeah, death. Death is fine. Death. Yes. Death is okay. <laughs> it's not like, you know, 99% of the Pokemon games that I do where it's like a Nuzlocke and I like cry because someone died. Uh, we're not doing a mascot playthrough where I'm like, we're bug trainers except for Turtwig. I have the right to, I have the right to revise that. Um... Real talk, I have the right to advise that. Um, but yeah, the general goal is just only bugs. If life sucks and it's miserable, I'll get Turtwig. I'll, I'll add Turtwig back because um, in, in the world of like main teams of who I would actually use, Turtwig is one of the grass types I would use. It's like Leafeon, Tangro. It's like Leafeon. If I don't have anyone else that's ground type, Torterra, then Tangrowth and Breloom. But um, for the grass types anyway. 
But uh, yeah, that's that's our general goal. So the it the only reason I'll do Turtwig is if um. Let's be honest. Having a team of only bug flying isn't fun, and having a team of um. Having a team of three Wormadams also isn't fun. Because, like, if three three Wormadams, Vespa Queen, Heracross, Cricketoon, maybe Shedinja, maybe a Ninjask, uh, Wurmple, Wurmple. You can kind of see there's a lot of, there's a lot of overlap. Okay, so... If I'm like, this sucks, and we all, we have basically the same Pokemon four times, I'm going to reserve the right to throw in Turtwig. And that way, that way, hey, if we take in Turtwig, right, that means he's, the rival is going to have a uh, Chimcharm on Inferno, Infernape. So we're still at a disadvantage. It's just we'll have a ground type on our team, which we'll already have because of Wormadam. So, anyways, enough talk. Let's go. Hello there. Let's see. Oh, let's backtrack a bit to your backlog games. Have you played Dying Light? If, if so, gonna add Dying Light to Stay Human. I forgot about that one. Thank you for telling me. That is one. That is one that people want me to play. And Dead Space. And Outlast. And Parasite Eve. And Kingsfield. And no, I'm kidding. <laughs> it's it does a lot. But hey, variety streamer. That's what we do, right? And as this isn't my full-time job, you know, we, we take our time, and it's fine. That's not to guilt, for the record. A anyways, hello there. It's so very nice to meet you. I don't know what this voice is. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. Oh, shit. I'm stately and British. My name is Rowan. However, everyone just calls me the Pokemon. I'm going to pretend he has a smoking he has a smoking addiction now. So, it's okay. Everyone just calls me the Pokemon Professor. <sighs> this world is widely inhabited by creatures known as Pokemon. Here's one of these little shits now. I caught him in the trash. Oh, golly, he is a little shit. He would be in the trash, wouldn't he? We humans live alongside Pokemon as friends. At times, we play together, and other times, we work together. Some people use their Pokemon to battle and develop closer bonds with them. What do I do? I eat the... I conduct research so that we may learn more about Pokemon. Now, why don't you tell me a little bit about yourself? <gasps> Guys, should I be a boy or a girl? I think the rule is because, um... He looks like the guy who would smoke a pipe. He... Alright, so... Okay, what, what's our what's our running joke? If the game is English... Or, sorry, if the game is American versus Japanese... Like, if it's American, I play a boy. If it's Japanese, I play a girl. And... Sometimes I play a girl to be stupid. I kind of think I have to be a girl so I could go with the bug theme of like, I am your queen, bitches. So I think I think I might have to go with being a girl. I think I think I, think I might have to be a girl. Uh, okay, shit. I actually came up with a name, but I need to hold on. Oh, uh, Starcraft Wiki Abathur. I want to see what the base words. I don't know. You're made up Pokemon. <laughs> Yeah, you got to play girl. You got it. All right. Um, the Pokemon rules, game rules in general. Okay, so let's look at Abathur's. Eight, is it etymology? Is it etymology? Of like what his name is, personality and traits. Ah, damn it. Um, eight. Uh... Okay, Starcraft Abathur name origins. I want to look at like what. Uh, Abathur. That's right. Sometimes called Abathur, and is an Uthra in the second period created by the, the father of the Uthras, angels, guardians. That's not quite what I was going for there. That's not quite what I was going for. Abathur. Map editor files included duplicate avatar actor names to Sanson, the description code that made it out as a producer. Sasson. Uh, I, need, I need a good name. I, I need a good name. I want it to be something to do with avatar. 
Why don't you just call yourself Abby? Hold on. I even spelled it right. It just occurred to me. <laughs> just like, wait a second, how do you spell Amethyst? I'm spelling it right, okay. My name is Abather. Mina. Ab My name's Abatharina, but everyone just calls me Abby. There you go. Your name is Abatharina. Yes, it is. A fine name, that is. Are, 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 are you oozing green? Ah. Ah. I'll tell you. Zeratulia. <laughs> like his name's Elliot, but it's Zeratulia. Zeratulia. <laughs> Uh, I don't know why that's funny to me. Alright, that's my friend's name. Wait, no, my friend. Is my friend or my rival? Um. Stukov. Stuk. Stukavri. Oh, yeah, it's my friend Stukavri over there. Hey, come on. All right, there you go, Stukavri. Good shit, yes. Excellent. All right, Abatharina, the time has come. <laughs> Why does everyone have such dumb name? Your very own tale of grand adventure is about to unfold. On your journey, you will meet countless Pokemon and people. I'm sure that along the way, you will discover many things, perhaps even something about yourself. Now, go on, leap into the world of Pokemon. Yo, let's spit out my mouth. Yay! Despite the exploration team's best efforts, the rare, oddly colored Pokemon eluded detection. The rumored Red Gyarados failed to appear, even fleetly, to the crestfallen team. What the fuck? Jeez! Mom, TV's giving me nightmares. <laughs> that concludes our special report. Search for the Red Gyarados. Gyar. Brought to you by Jubilife TV on Nationwide Net. Isn't that in... Second generation? Gen 4. See you next week. Same time, same channel. That thing... I am so flipping cute. Oh my goodness. Oh, shit. Don't tell me I live my life, game. Fuck you. Alright, fast. Whoa. Oh, shit. I don't know I'm if that. Back. <laughs> well, that makes me happy that that played. Thank you so much, Thembo. That's very generous of you. That that is that is very kind of you. Thank you. I really appreciate that. Uh, what? Shh. I counted sixty-two bits just for that. Yeah. Um. I'm not gonna lie. That it took a hot minute to make all those, but it. It, it makes me happy. I, I hope I hope people have fun with them. But thank you so much. I re I really appreciate that. That means a lot to me. But like, okay. I remember when the first trailers for this game came out, and um, and a lot of people were like, "Oh my goodness, the chibi style looks like ass." Blah blah blah. This is fucking adorable. I am so fucking cute. Ah, uh, I, I don't need that shit. I don't need that shit. Fuck you! I invented all the DNA of Pokemon. I commend your efforts, though, of counting out 62. But th thank you. Alright, Abatharina, Stukavri, kept calling for you a little while. I don't know what it's about, but he said it was an emergency. Alright, cool. I'm gonna watch TV. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Can I have a cookie. Don't go to the tall grass. Wild Pokemon might attack you. It'd be okay if you had your own Pokemon, but you don't. So, give me a damn cookie. Give me a damn cookie. I require. Oh, wait, no, no, no. Abathur never says the word I. Sustenance required. Talking to you 
illogical. Sign placement, illogical. Who the fuck are you, child? Don't tell me I live my damn life. Oh, fuck you! Stakavri was looking for you. I think he's home now. Why don't you go check it out? Fuck you! This deterrent will not stop my rise. Golly, help them! Ah! Fuck you! <laughs> what was that about? Oh, hey, Abathurina. I'm going to the lake. You should come too and be quick about it. Okay, Abathurina, I'm handing you one million if you're late. Do you like how my hair is just insane? Like, my hair is just... God, I wish I could fluke my hair like that. My hair looks so greasy. Oh, jeez, I forgot something! Your very own gun! Welcome to Russia! You look so done with his shit. Oh, hi, Abathurian. Did you come calling on Stukavri? He was gone for a second, but he came running right back home. He just can't sit still, that boy. I wonder who he takes after. Definitely not his father! Who's never home! Alright. Uh, I'm just gonna invade people's houses. What the fuck are you? Yeah, that's great. I could style my hair like that. I would need a hair product or it would need to be greasy. Yeah, like the few times I've had a hair product, I just hate it because it's like all greasy and gross. You know what I mean? Oh my goodness. Fuck off, kid. How about that? Your DNA is not worthy of the swarm. You will be consumed for bioflesh or biomass. I better take my ga my bag. I better take my gag and my bide book. And the TV that looks like it's gonna fall and break my neck. We're going to the lake. I'll be waiting. It's a 10 million fine if you're late. I'm gonna break your ankles, kid. Oh. I'm gonna absolutely break your ankles. I just want you to know that. I'm go I'm going to kill you. Stukavri, I hate your guts. I'm going to kill you for your butt. Fuck you, kid. I'm going to kill you for your bioflesh. Biomass. Hey, you saw that news report that was on TV, right? <laughs> that show got me thinking. I'll bet our local lake has Pokemon like that too. I'm trying to skip word. So that's what we're gonna do. We'll find a Pokemon like that, eh? I'm gonna kick my desk. No, no, no. No, he, he... Oh, shit, you're following me. No, he said it. I didn't say that shit, he did. Stukov, if there isn't a damn bug. Actually, there is a bug that's supposed to be here. There is a bug that's supposed to be here, but um, it only shows up on swarms. What's going on? I want to. I want to roll to push that red kid into the, into the lake. Professor, there's nothing out of the out of the ordinary on the other side either. Hmm, I may have. Oh, hmm, I may have been mistaken. My small, small arm. <laughs> Something appears to be different than it was before, but fine. It's enough that we have seen the lake. It sure still is there. Lucas, we're leaving. Professor, you've been gone for four years now. How are you enjoying being back in Sinnoh? Hmm, there is one thing I can say. There are many rare kinds of Pokemon in Sinnoh. The region should serve us very well in regard to our studies. Our study. Excuse me, let us pass, please. Give me a damn Pokemon, I'll consider it. Sorry, folks. What was that about, those two? I came for my damn Pokemon. Huh, Abathurina, let's go check this out. What's that? Don't go to the tall grass? No, fuck that, I wanna go into the tall grass. We won't be in there long enough for a while Pokemon to come out. I think I've talked about this before, but... If in real life Pokemon were real, I would be completely cool with fist fighting one in order to catch it. Like I know they're like murderous or whatever, but like me versus a Pikachu, I'd be willing to take that bet. I I, th I think I could take on like a level two Pikachu with my bare fists. I, I I think I could do it as an adult. I don't know about you guys, but I, I feel confident in that. It's a briefcase. Those people forgot here. What are we supposed to do with it? We can try to return it, but who were they? Check it for money! I heard them say, Professor. 
That fucking bird! Piece of Ibby level two. Piece of shit! What's going on? Alright, I'm gonna take the briefcase and I'm gonna I'm gonna uh Death Stranding. I'm gonna death stranding that shit. Just grab it by the thing and just whip that shit around. Which one do you want? You wanna fist fight a Zubat? Ah, uh, that'd be hard though, because they're like all flappy and shit, like. But you, we could probably do it. Even a Geodude, right? Like, sure, it's made of rocks, but just like grab it by the arm and just start slamming it into shit, you know what I mean? Alright. <gasps> He's so cute. I hate him. Okay, you're pretty cute. No, 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 no. I'm, t I'm taking this damn Turtwig. Look how cute he is. Oh my goodness. Don't you so cute? Yeah, fucking bird piece of shit. Let's go, asshole. All right, uh, tackle. Yeah. Back. Oh, and I gotta, I gotta do a thing real quick. Hold on. Uh. There you go. We're starting a new Pokemon game. Everyone knows what that means. Actually, maybe I'll make it. Maybe I'll make it like way smaller than before. I don't know. Oh, bro, he looks like a boss on Last Evolution. <laughs> the Turtwig? Heck yeah. He a big chunker. Hold on. All right, uh, I need a. I need a personal opinion. How big should that be? Should we make it like way smaller, or is that like a good size? Like that. Like that kind of a deal. Is that a good size or should we make it smaller? Fwa, your Turtwig totally rocked. But my Chimchar was way tougher than yours. How would you go fuck it? They were other people's Pokemon. But we had to use them. Those people won't, oh, those people won't mind, will they? I say a little smaller, but it looks good now. We, we can, we can make it smaller. How about... Actually, hold on. Hold on. Let me make a... Let me make a copy of it. Yeah, let me make a copy of it in case you don't like it. How about... That, and then... Should we put it... Nah. Alright, how about that? Because I mean, okay, on one side, because we're doing a Nuzlocke, um, having... Because we're doing a Nuzlocke, we don't really need to worry about having a scoreboard as much, you know what I mean? Now you guys are here, this is the start of the series, I'm, I'm, I'm totally cool with taking you guys to film this. There's also another one I can do that's like that, that can make it way small like this kind of a deal. You guys think that looks good? Yeah, this, this, is, a, this is not a Nuzlocke. This is not a Nuzlocke. That's why I was saying earlier, if someone dies, it's no big deal. How about that? How about, how about just like how about just like that? That way it's nice and out of the way. Uh, chat would sit there normally, but you know chat goes by pretty quick. Either looks good. Okay, cool. And right, let me just put the basics above. So now, 
so now when Shaq goes, it'll be over it. There you go, see? Now you can still see chat and you can see our Pokemon all nice and clean, right? So That's a weird icon I have by my name, but I'm not gonna worry about that. Anyways, let us continue. Woo, you found the briefcase. The professor would have gone to the roof if I if he knew I forgot it here, or threw it in the lake. Your asshole stole the Pokemon! You're gonna be fucking dead! Did you guys did you guys use these Pokemon? Oh man, how am I gonna explain this to the professor? They've imprinted on you! This is the professor's briefcase, so I'll take it, okay? I guess you can just keep those Pokemon. What was uh, what was that about? I ain't giving up this monkey for shit. I don't know what's going on, Abatharina. Let's get out of here. My Pokemon got hurt from that battle. If we get attacked by another Pokemon, we might be in trouble. You're a bitch. Fuck you, Stuka. You and your stupid ass infected humans. Fuck they got. They're dumb. It's a stupid mechanic. You go ahead. I know we have to go return these Pokemon. They're not ours. Why don't you just spend a little more time with this little guy? Fuck you. If we're gonna go return them, we're gonna go return them now, asshole. We're not just gonna steal them. They're not ours. Don't be a dick. Hey, it's those people. Is that old guy staring at us? Fucking run! Hmm. I heard from Lucas that you used our Pokemon. Let me see them, please. Oh, God, you broke Chimchar's arm. Turtwig and Chimchar. I see, that's how it is. Lucas, I'm going back to my lab. Do you want him back? I understand. I understand. Uh, yeah, of course, Professor. Wait for me. You should visit us at our lab later, I think. We'll be seeing you. Fighters, keepers, losers, weaker. <laughs> losers, weepers, just like you, Kure. What was all that craziness about? I mean, if he was angry, he could have just yelled at us or whatever. Didn't he want his Pokemon back? Abatharina, we should go home too. Fuck that, I'm going straight to the lab. Damn it. Mom! Mom, I have a turtle! Mom, it's my turtle, I've earned it! What's up, dear? Wow, I can't believe that happened to you. Nature is dangerous. Am I ever glad that both you and Stukavri are unharmed? The professor you mentioned is most likely Professor Rowan of San Gem Ta San Gem. I've heard that he is well known for his studies on Pokemon. I hear he's also quite intimidating and very handsome. Abathrina, I think you need to visit him in San Gem Town. You need to properly explain why you had no choice but to use his Pokemon. Take my phone number with you. Don't worry, I'm sure he will understand. I'm leaving Stukavri behind. Oh, I know, Abathrina. Put these on. Yes! Yes! Going to San Jim Town is like an adventure in itself, right? With those running shoes, you can get to faraway places much faster. Okay, let me read the instructions. Was that just nifty? Yeah! 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 Can I name? Can I name the church twig? Check summary. How do I? How do I name the Pokemon? I want to name him. Hmm. Alright, fine. You're acting like the first does it not already know where you're from. <laughs> That's the reason he moved in. It's like, I'm gonna be visiting your mother. Your mother is a very beautiful lady who I wish to court in a very respectful and put a very respectful and consensual way. I'm dating your mom, okay? Let's just get that out of the way right now. I'm dating your mom. There's no I'm sorry, okay? Like, look, sometimes you gotta learn the hard truths about life, and today is one of those days. I'm dating your mother. Not much for it. Oh, wait a second, I don't have Pokeballs. I just realized that. I was mentally thinking, like, okay, we should find a Crick soon, soon, but we, we don't have any Pokeballs. Awkward for everyone involved. This is... Ooh, yeah. Excuse me? What are you doing here? Wild Pokemon lurk in tall grass. They can come bursting out at any time. So if you're wanting to bow wild Pokemon, just walk in tall grass. If you want to avoid wild Pokemon, then stay out of the tall grass. I'm paid every time I say the words tall grass. I just want you to know that. Like, I am not telling you this information. For free. 
The prof was invited over for tea and crumps. It's straight to the bedroom. <laughs> they, they, they just hit it off that way. Look, I don't know who my dad is, okay? I, not in real life. My dad is awesome, okay? My real life dad is kick ass. He is literally called the voice of reason by many people. But I, I don't know where my dad is in this game. Should I even bother going around the grass? I mean... No sacrifice. Oh. oh crap! That's what I'm looking for. Um, donation accepted. Resources allocated. Only a one Pokemon game have we known our dad. Wasn't that the um, Norman? Norman the was that Gen three? Where our dad was a gym leader? I love that. Yeah. Hi, I've been waiting for you. Please come with me. The professor's waiting to see you. Do you fight one of those... Those poodoofs? <laughs> Thud. What the? Oh, it's you, Abathorina. I told them it was all your idea. That old guy, he's not scary so much as he is totally out there. Ah, oh, it doesn't matter, Abathorina. I'm out of here. See you later. I'm keeping this monkey. What was that? Your friend always seems to be in such a rush. Anyway, let's go in. And then we're gonna go break his ankle. Just real quick. It'll, it'll be fine. Don't worry about it. Hmm. Finally, you come, Abutharina, was it? Let me see that Pokemon again. That... It's a thing. Alrighty then, I'll give that Turtwig to you as a gift. Oh shit. Now that's yours, would you like to give it a nickname? Yes! Alright, everyone. All right, everyone. Uh, okay, indifferentlanguages.com. I'm gonna look up the word seedbed. Perfect. Yes, I'm naming Turtwig Seedbed. Uh, planter in baskets, has tagi, sabed, zabibed, time lava. Kilvolava. Kil well, he's a busy guy and his kid getting involved with it. Probably doesn't that endear yourself to it. <laughs> well, I need to date your mother. Take this turtle and get the fuck out. Yes, I know everyone's made that joke. Um, Turpy, Sambet, Seabed, Hamalia. I want something that sounds strong. Miao Chuang, that's Chinese. Although I'm probably pronouncing it wrong. Miao Sang, I'm also probably pronouncing that wrong. Seabed, 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 seabed. Yo hat, Urig Konadir. Sad bit, sev. I'm gonna go back to that one that's like Kilo. Semena. That's because I'm gonna make semen jokes if I. Time lava. Kilvo lava! I like Kilva Lava. We're going Seed Bed. Seed Bed. I'm gonna go Kilo Lava, which is, um, or Semele. Yeah, but I'm gonna come Smelly. Um, Kilo Lava, except there's a. Or Kilvo. Let's see if I can get the. Yeah, get them double dots. Kilvalava. Kilvalava. And you're happy with that nickname? Fuck yeah, I am. Your friends to Kavri told me what happened at the lake. I heard you bowed very well, despite it being your first time. I kinda threw your ass to the wolves. Let's just be honest with ourselves for a second. And from what I can see, there is a growing bond between you and that Pokemon, though it is still young. That's why I would like to entrust you with Turtwig. Fuck yeah. Am I ever glad you're kind towards Pokemon? If you weren't, well, I don't even want to think about it. You, we are all so cute. Ahem. Let's move on to the main topic. There's something I want you to do for me. First, give me the number to your mom. Thank you. Second, my name is Rowan. I study Pokemon. First of all, I want to know exactly what kind of Pokemon live in the Sinnoh region. I don't live here. To do so, uh, this is what I wish to ask of you. I want to entrust you with this Pokedex. We use it to record data on all the Pokemon in Sinnoh for me? Yeah, sure. Good answer. Yeah, I'll do it. Yeah, I'll be fine. Uh, yeah. 
That Pokedex is a very high-tech device. You will automatically record data on every kind of Pokemon you encounter. How it actually works is beyond us, frankly. Abathrina, I ask that you go everywhere and meet every kind of Pokemon in this region. I've got the same kind of Pokedex you. Shut the fuck up, Lucas. No one cares. When you, walk, when you walked up Route 201 with your Pokemon, what did you feel? Anger. Hatred. Desire for power. I've lived for 60 long years. Even now, I get a thrill when I'm with a Pokemon. Now you should know that there are countless Pokemon in this world. Like, 490. Yeah, that means there are just as many thrills waiting for you out there. Now go, Abathrina. Your grand adventure begins right now. Get out of my house. The professor asked me to help, so I'm going to go and fill the Pokedex badges, too. Page, page. That makes us comrades working towards the same goal. I'll teach you stuff later, okay? I'm going to adjust something with my... I'm going to adjust something with my lights. He probably says something along the lines of, like... He probably says something along the lines of, like, nonsense, Mr. Poopy Pants, if you're going to do it. Or maybe he did mind the thoughts, but, like, that's not a very good attitude to have. You know, you should... You should be a bit more excited when I give you a superpower war weapon. Uh, there. I think that makes the that make the light on me look a little nicer, a little less bright kind of video. All right, so oh, you couldn't hear me. Um, I imagine he admonishes you and is just like, no, you should be excited. You should go out and explore, and you don't really mean that. And blah blah blah. Huh? Thank you, Lucas's father. Sorry about that. Hey, Abathrina, I want to show you a few things, so follow me. I'm about to sneeze. This building with the red roof is- that's not red. It is the Pokemon Center. You can get your Pokemon healed if it's been hurt in battle. You'll find the Pokemon Center in most towns. This is called a rogue. Over here, the building with the blue roof is a Pokemart. It's a shop where you can buy and sell all sorts of items. Since you're rookie trainer, you won't be able to buy very much stuff. Don't worry about it, okay? This is a meritocracy as a country. Uh. Uh. I don't want to go heal up my Pokemon. Fuck you. You don't get to tell me how to live my life. Town of Sand. Uh, Lucas is. Uh, I'm gonna go talk to mom. Actually, wait, hold on. Do I, do I have? Do, do 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 I? Okay, I don't. I don't have any balls. I don't have any balls. I need balls. I will purchase balls. Give me your damn balls. Yeah. Boy. You're too late, the professor's already visited. Damn it. Fucking professor. Horning in on my mom. I have to kill him for that. Your essence will be useful. You exhibit high ranges of intelligence. That will be ideal for the swarm. Ah, right, there we go. I'm flat out broke. I literally spent all my money. All right, there we go. Like the second he gave you the Pokedex, he was gone. <laughs> I gotta stop you from flirting with my mom. Alright, okay, so on my list, on my list of Pokemon we need to catch, um, Route 201. Uh, 201 is, okay, there is no, there are no bugs in Route 201, so we don't give a shit. Alright, just straight up, we don't, we don't give a shit. Alright, that's gonna be the other thing that's gonna be, like, really freeing, I think, about this playthrough of Pokemon. Because we're not worried about endlessly catching and about endlessly, like, we're not worried about endlessly catching, we're not going to be worried about endlessly training, it's going to be just grab your Pokemon and go. Once you have our team, just go. What's up, Abathrina? Wow, Professor Rowan asked you to do something that big. Okay, dear, go for it. Your mom's got your back. Oh, I know, Abathrina, I've got something that you'll find useful. Here's a hat. Uh... That's a guidebook. Take a look at it when you're curious about something or have questions. Certainly, you mean I envy you, kiddo. I never got to go on an adventure. I'm a permanent stay-at-home. Plus, you're not alone. You have your Pokemon with you. I wish I could go instead. Why don't Why don't you? I'm just joking, Abba Serena. 
I'll be alright by myself, dear. So you go and enjoy your adventure. When you're exposed to new things and experience new sensations, it makes your mother happy too. But please come back sometimes. So I would like to see the kinds of Pokemon you've caught, dear. Mom, are you okay? Like, real talk, are you okay? Excuse me, is my little Stukavri here? Uh, oh, then he must have left already. What to do? That boy's shy about going on an adventure, then he bolted. <laughs> Bye, bitch! <laughs> He's so headstrong and reckless, I at least want him to take this. Not to worry, Abitharina will deliver that to him. The fuck I will. Won't you, Abitharina? Ugh. Ugh. Whatever. Bye-bye, Abitharina. Enjoy your adventure. Let me think. Knowing my boy, he would probably head straight to Jubilife City. Okay, please take that to my Stukafri. I'm so fucking fast. <gasps> Is it a hug? Mm -hmm. That's, I mean, it's a hat. It's a nice hat. Yes, that hat always did suit you well, Abitharina. Off you go. You got it. You got it, Mama. Love you. All right. So now if we... Now, if we find any normal bitches, it's fine. We're just not gonna catch them. Is that thing shiny? Or is that just the lighting? That's just the lighting. I was gonna say, like, holy shit, cute, uh, cute the lava. Shiny bird. Fuck. Yeah, suck it, bird. Oh my goodness. You did so little damage. I'm gonna turn down my volume a little bit. Uh, how's the volume for you guys, by the way? Is it good? Am I too loud? Is the game too loud? Just real quick. Oh my goodness, I'm so. Oh, I got leafage! I'm fucking bruiser! Let's fucking go! Alright, uh, is this way to Jubilife? I don't give a shit, it's Route 202. Alright, move side! Move side, I need my bug. Do you know how to catch a Pokemon? I'll demonstrate how to catch one, so just watch, okay? Fuck you. Fuck you, okay? I can do it my damn self. I don't give a shit. It's fuck Badoof. No one likes Badoof. That's not the case. That's not for a lot of people. I don't give a shit. You got Piplup, up, you bitch. I'm gonna fight you. That's about all I had to say on the matter. Yeah, I forget. That's about it. I kinda wish they let you be like, yo, would you like to learn how to, would you like to learn how to catch a Pokemon? You could be like, yes or no. So that way I could be like, yes, I know. And they'd be like, oh shit, really? And I'd be like, yes. And they'd be like, oh. Okay. That'd be the end of it. I can't spell Crick Uh, Cause we're, that's the next thing we're gonna catch. Uh. Guess I shouldn't have spent all my money on Pokeballs, but oh well. Alright, uh, this... I'm actually gonna go the other way real quick. Yeah, I'm gonna go the other way really quick because there was a route down here. 219. Um, ow. Alright, let's keep going! Alright. Everyone start coming up with a good name for a Krikatot. Oh shit. Probably find a xylophone pun. Uh, you're a Pokemon trainer. I happen to be a Pokemon trainer. Our eyes met, so battle we must! Okay. Something's weird about your straight child, but alright. I wonder, is it gonna... It tells you if it's not very effective or not. Okay, cool. So they still have that, which is nice. I am so... Weak buff. Oh, you're level five. Oh, shit. Nah, 
keep on the offensive. I don't have a reason not to. I'm so freaking buff. Yeah. Yeah. Kind of wish I could have got a bug beforehand so I could have milked some experience, but too strong, too strong. Give me your money. Money, kid. Fuck it. Oh, I'm definitely gonna need to. Hold on. I am so cute. I'm so unbelievably cute. Alright, um. I'm gonna. Use potion. There we go. Oh, she. I survived my little eye trainer. A battle, please. Oh, so something, something I kind of want to talk about. So, um. Uh, what was it? This was a few weeks ago. A few weeks ago, my sister asked me. I was in a car drive with my sister because we were coming back from gun show. Or not gun show, it was the Living History Fair. But, um. My sister Anne asked me about, like, oh, so you know, what games do you plan on streaming? And I mentioned, um. Uh, Legend of Arceus, or whatever it's called. And I, I told her the premise, to the best of my knowledge, and this is probably wrong, of like. All right, it's Edo period Japan, and God gives you a cell phone, and then it's a normal, like, Pokemon whatever adventure. And when I initially told her about that it was an Edo period, she had a, like, she just, she just had an idea of, like, oh, so do you have to, like, because you don't have technology, do you have to, um, like, get a sketchbook and sit there and, like, draw the Pokemon and, like, write down notes and observe them and stuff. And we just started, like, talking back and forth. Before we know it, I was reminded of it when, um, the professor gave me a Pokedex. And in, like, five minutes, we came up with, like, a way, a game that I would love to play someday for Pokemon. And it was basically, it was basically insert however long in the past, right? Like, you know, just whatever the context is before this Pokedex is, right? Imagine a Pokemon game where instead of having to do gyms, you're a, you are a professor in training or whatever. Where the heck is this one? Okay. You're a professor in training. And you have to, like, sneak up and observe Pokemon without being seen because maybe they're, like, skittish. And, like, maybe there'd be, like... Forgot Shinx was the thing. Forgot about that. That's somewhat intimidating, not gonna lie. It's a little. A little, a little oof. Especially because it has intimidate, that's a super good ability. But, um. Like, what if your rival. Like, uh, what if it's your job to, like, go out into the wild and, like, examine Pokemon? And you have to, like. Maybe because, you know, it's a video game, you, you would, like, um. It would be like a connect the dot kind of a thing and like the more times you observe the Pokemon the better your pictures get and then you have to like do uh, maybe there'd be either be like a fill in the blank or there'd be like a multiple choice thing of like this Pokemon is roughly this big hangs out in these kinds of areas eat these kinds of things they tend to do X they're strong enough to do Y the odd behavior is Z and you would have to like fill it out and if you got it wrong the game would not correct you. you. It would just let you write whatever and be like, all right. And then there would be someone that you would have to like give a report to of being like, and like you'd, you'd have to like do all this scientific research and then, I like how fast that is. You'd have to like do the scientific research and observation and then you could make the decision to catch them because you have to, you have to observe them in the wild. You can't just you can't just snatch them out of the wild and claim they're yours. No, you gotta you gotta sit there and observe them in their natural habitat because they like different ones in captivity. But like once you've been approved that you did enough research, then you can catch it, kind of a deal. And your rival, he's also researching Pokemon, but he's doing uncouth methods and like like effectively poaching, kind of a deal. And what I realized we were talking about was basically take Legend of Arceus, a little bit of that, that I've seen of it, right? Take Legend of Arceus, take Pokemon Snap, and make and like mash them together and make them both like way, way intense. 
like just super super intensive and i was like i would love to play a game like that uh uh there's a training school check it out oh, yeah Stuart, i went to the training school earlier okay see you around work hard in your pokedex all right uh okay hold on right route 202 Oh no. Oh no. Uh, shit, I forgot time is a thing in this game. Yes. Alright, um. Uh. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, 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 Okay, wait, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Um, okay, what's, what time is time in general? Uh, uh, okay. The default time is 10 a.m. Okay, times of day. So, daytime is 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. Nighttime is 6 p.m. to 4 a.m. Morning is 4 a.m. to 10 a.m. So, if in game. Is it considered nighttime? Because, I mean, if I go to my. 7. Is it nighttime? It's only a 10% chance? It's only a 10% chance? Is uh, okay. okay, hold on. 30, 30, 30. Cricket is really tiny. So we could be sitting here for a while trying to get a cricket. To uh, thankfully, most Pokemon I'm going for are. Um, they require honey. But where do honey trees first show up? Is 205. Route 205. Fuck. That's bad. I didn't think of that. I, I, I didn't... I didn't think of that in my calculations. Ooh. You might not be running a Pokemon for a while. What's... Hey. Don't stop me. Fuck you. Alright, um... You look important. You look important. No. Uh. No. Fuck off. I'm not even part of your group. I don't know you. Um. Oh, this, this could be bad. Oh, good. You let me through. All right. Um. Okay, so basic. Okay. Uh. Okay, so this this is this is actually kind of bad. We might not be working with another Pokemon for a while. I was hoping to get Cricketot as soon as possible, so that way we could start training him. Because if I remember correctly, the XP share is like built in now. It's not a. It's not just like a whatever. That clown can go screw itself. Okay. Um. Okay, there's two of four. She, she is, she's on the ball right now. She, she's, she ain't going nowhere. She says, your ass is mine. All right, um, okay, hold on, hold on. So, so brilliant diamond, brilliant pearl, okay. Uh, okay, so it's a 10% chance for night and day here. So it's a little better. It's a little better chance, but it depends if it thinks it's daytime or not. I don't know if this game thinks it's daytime or not. I guess we could try to find a in-game claw. Oh, fuck off. Ah. Fuck off. All right. Um. 
before we continue, I want to try and get a Cricket Todd. I have the list here of what Pokemon should show up. So hopefully, Starly shows up in all three. Basically, if I see a Zubat, that'll be an indicator. Actually, yeah, I gotta, I gotta get rid of this. Basically, I'm hoping to see a Zubat. So we're gonna we're gonna be here for a little bit looking for Cricket Todd. I'm sorry, everyone. Uh, just wait till we get to the tree that has the. Just wait till we get to the tree that um, we catch the rest of the Pokemon in. Heracross, which, trust me, we are getting a Heracross. We are 100% getting a Heracross. Guess what percent chance he has of showing up? If you had to guess, what percent chance? One. One percent. One percent chance to show up. I really like how fast this is. This feels nice. Yeah. It's... It's rough. It's just... Just a tad rough. So we're gonna be here for a little bit. Because... The yeah. Um... Oh shit. Uh in Gen 4. Uh I don't know what What are the times in Pokemon Brilliant Diamond? Because daytimes from 10 a.m. to 8 p.m. with the transition die occurring at exactly 8 p.m. Ass. All right, so that means, uh, yeah, save ourselves some time. Krikatot is not going to show up. We're just going to have to deal, all right? That's just, that's our, oh, shit. That's just our lives at the, lives at the moment. We're just going to have to deal. Uh, thankfully, the honey tree isn't time dependent. What? I'm sorry, what? I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. Um, actually, I'm, I'm gonna go back to this one. I'm pretty beat up. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. There you go. Did you try to type something? or miss? I'm, so, I'm sorry. Uh, there you go. We'll go heal. Uh Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm sorry about that. Sorry, I'm text. Oh god, guys, my heart. My heart breaks. No. Fuck off. I don't need any of you. It's odd. I don't need any of you. Where's my, where's my I don't even want Krikatai. I don't even want Krikatai. Uh. Yeah, there you go. Take your, take your freaking letter. There's Troy can't fix heartbreak. <laughs> fix my indigestion. Uh. Smell you later. Alright, get out. Do any of you actually give me anything? Oh, shh. None. Uh. Kids play Minecraft. Uh? Okay, sure. Good for that. Although there is a certain logic to if I just kind of tootle around and try to like do stuff that doesn't involve battling for 30 minutes, but nah, I'm not going to worry too hard about that. I'm just going to gonna go for it. Nah, I'm just going to charge beam. What the fuck? Holy shit. 
Um, that's kind of scary. Not gonna lie, that's um. I was fully expecting it to be like, oh, it used teleport. It didn't work. Uh, no, it's using charge beam. That's impressive. Kill the lava is gonna be evolved before we even get the rest of our bugs. Give me your money. I don't know how much money we're gonna need for honey. God, I, I feel like that. Is it gonna be like one honey a try and we're gonna be gambling for the 1%? Oh god. That's gonna suck. Hopefully it's like, uh, hopefully the honey is reusable or something. I don't know. That, that's good. That's good. Bad. You also have charge beam. What the heck? What's with you two? And how do I get charge beam? I want charge beam. Oh, God. I want charge beam. Give it to me. I don't know if I have anyone that can even use it. Like, even thinking full teams, I don't think I have anyone that can even use charge beam, but I want it. I might be able to find someone. Maybe Beautify can use it. <gasps> yes. Yes. Oh shit, it's a one time use. Ah, oh, damn it. Workup might be really good for Heracross, so I'll hold on to it. Oh, what do you want? Leave me alone. Ah. Uh. Uh. to kick him in the shin. Max, you can't just roll to kick him in the shin. I roll to kick him in the shin. Yes. Uh, fat whatever. Just leave me alone. It's a freaking clown. Uh, 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 just don't, don't talk to me. I'm a small child and you're an adult clown. I feel uncomfortable. You're gonna get drunk and do drugs and cut off my fingers and eat them. <laughs> yeah, sure, whatever. God. Okay. Thanks. Give me a smart punch. Uh, poke the Pikachu. The thing is huge. Okay. All right, so guarantee we're gonna have to wait. Guarantee we're gonna have to wait at. Okay, there's Flora Town. Okay, so there's two of two. That's where that's where we just came from. So there's Orberg. Okay, so the next place that I'm interested in is 205, which is the next town up. So we're gonna see if we can cheese the system a little bit and just head up there. And oh. I was about to say, and we'll try to avoid fights. We'll try our best to avoid fights, but I'm suddenly feeling like that's not a possibility. Yeah. If we can avoid fights, so that way we can like switch in Turtwig and, oh shit, I'm hurt. Oh God, I'm really hurt. Um, try to make this fast. There you go. And they are driving me nuts. They make me feel unkempt, so I'm gonna sit here and, and pull them out of here. Oh shit! Growth? Fuck yeah! 
It's awesome. Oh, I shouldn't have battled in the first place. Damn straight. Shouldn't know what you're getting your ass into. That's a world of hurt. With those hands. There. I'll throw my little dude a... I'll throw a kilo lava potion. See if we can avoid you. Ah, damn it! Child! My dad gave me some Pokemon. They're gonna win for me. Child. Leave me alone. Oh my goodness, you have so many Pokemon. Wow. Dad gave you a goldfish. Ow. I'm uh oh shit, I did I did I did not mean to do that. It's okay, I just Dad sure does love his kid. He's like, yeah, yeah. You really can defend yourself against strangers and um birds. Next one's like a Gyarados, but it's like level four for no good reason. It's just a level four Gyarados. You're like, what the fuck? Oh, okay, there you go. That that's that's better. That's all right. All right. That's that's more acceptable. Oh, it's gonna break my heart if the first gym is flying type or something like that. I don't remember what the gyms are in this game. Yeah, like the first gym, if it's flying type, we're gonna have to do some work. We're gonna have to grind. And just pray that we can just outspeed and outpower. Because otherwise, we're gonna be trouble. There you go. Yeah, you sit there and keep growling. Yeah, you, you sit there. You sit there and keep growling. Oh. Your master strategy didn't work. Oh, 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 no. Oh, no. The Pokemon I got from my dad. My dad. Sneak, sneak by a ravaged path. What the fuck? Oh, no. No. If the path is blocked because of rocks, that means we're gonna have to beat the first gym before we get the rest of our Pokemon. Damn it. You got a freaking Badoo. Way to hit me with that insomnia. I'm sure. I really don't understand what the point of that move is, besides, like, someone keeps using rests. I don't really know what it's good for, to be honest with you. I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna keep Okay, maybe we can, um, maybe we can, like, scout out and see if we can sneak through, but I'm willing to bet they're gonna cut us off early. Yep. <sighs> yep. Fucking annoying. Ugh. I was, I was actually really hoping to get um Heracross by the end of the night. But it's fine. We'll build it, build it. I won't be happy about it. But we'll live. Also, I just want you to know, special defense is my lowest stat, except maybe for speed. That was a critical hit. And you did one point of damage. Consider. Just consider your life choices. Alright, so in that case, we gotta run to the right. Yeah, we got we gotta run this way. Oh god. Oh god, what do you want? Uh, uh. That's so weird to have a three to why'd you only catch one Pokemon? I'm like, shut up. Shut up. Working on it. Uh, 
Oh god, you're level 7 too? Oh, good. Good shit. Alright. Alright, we may have to cheese. Until we get to that one j until we get to those um, other Pokemon start training them up as well, we might legit have to... Oh, fuck you. There's a, there's a good likelihood we might have to cheese this shit a bit. Because we're kind of in a rough situation, especially because he's about to whip out Jimchar, who you know knows fire moves. He's probably also level 10 if Starly's on the side, so... Uh, this is gonna be good. This is no rollout, nope, or bite or anything. Oh, uh, okay. So I got two levels on you, but I'm hurt, and my attack has been lowered. All right, let's hope you're stupid. Let's hope you're stupid. Oh my goodness, that's gonna take so long. The game's like, wow, you're clearly losing. I better use a scratch instead of Ember. My Pokemon's HP is low. This could be a bit tight. Oh, yeah, is it? Is it, is it? is it? Is it a bit tight? Is it? Is it a piece of shit? Is it a bit tight? Uh. Critical? No. Nah. Okay. Um. That's where I'm gonna start looking at fire moves. Alright, I'm gonna be an asshole. Yep, I'm gonna be a dick. What you gonna do about it? That's what you're gonna do about it, I guess. And that's going down way faster than before. I could sit here and withdraw and growth to like make up lost ground, but I'm not even gonna bother. There's no point. I might as well just I might as well just keep slapping. What just happened? I lost. It's like his HP refilled for no reason. It's crazy. That's it. That's the last time I'll ever lose. I'm going to be the world's toughest trainer, and you know it. The first thing to do is take on the Orberg City Pokemon Gym. I'm going to toughen up for that totally. Right on, my son. Right on. All right. Um, I need to heal. I need to heal. And I need to avoid fights, if possible, for the next 20 minutes. Once the clock strikes 8, 8 p.m. for me anyway, then we gotta fight a quick tot. Then we gotta catch it. Name it Xylophone. Name the Pokemon Xylophone. Make it work. At least for a little bit until we can get Rock Smash. Damn it! I found a trainer while looking for some Pokemon. Ah, look at this little wench over here running around trying to avoid fights and shit. Fuck that. Here's three of them. Oh god. Oh god. Okay, at least they're all level four. So hopefully, I, if I can not speed you, that'll look. And all I can think of is, man, if I had a Krikata right now, this would be awesome. Because then you get a lot of really good experience. I could probably have him do the fights and then, like, switch in. But, Once we have him, we'll, we'll run through all the trainers. And we'll run through all the trainers and let him lead so he gets more experience. Nice. Nice showcase of all the basic Pokemon in here. One. One. Wow, that actually healed a good amount. Probably because that was one hit point for him. There you go. 
Yep. You finished so soon? Still our big city. So that works out. Uh, I can't believe I have to. No, oh, no. Oh god! You got poke catch. Uh. Uh. Thank you. You'll first need a jet badge from Orberg City! Damn it! Thank you, mister. I really appreciate it. Ugh. Okay, they're fine. Ah, oh, shit! Uh, fuck you. Fuck you. I'm gonna go murder that shit right now. How about that? I don't even have cricket tie yet. I'll murder that shit. Hearing your hope get crushed was funny. Uh, he's sort of twitchy and impatient. Yeah, I, I regularly tell him that he can go fuck himself. That's Samus. I'm sorry. Hold on. Is this a Pokemon Brilliant Diamond version of Samus? I think it is. What the heck? All right. Um. I'm gonna play in the coal. I'm gonna play in the coal refinery. I'm gonna play in the coal refinery, and you can't stop me. No, I just can't. I, I like. I recognize there's a certain amount of max. You're avoiding everyone. You're not talking to people. You're not doing things. Coal, my hand. You. Would you like the black one? All right. Um. Yeah, there's a certain amount of max avoids. There's a certain amount of I'm avoiding everywhere I can, but that's because I really want a Krikatot. And this next area has a Zubat, Zubat at the top. Dude, Krikotot, okay. I want to get those Pokemon in my team as soon as possible, so that way there's no wasted experience, especially if I plan on... Um... Fuck you. Um, oops. yeah, I know. I'm trying to like avoid fights and stuff so that way I can get experience to my other Pokemon. That's that shit ain't happening. Oh, god! Well, Bembo said they could take you to fist fight. Ready to catch these. Oh god, you're level eight. You're gonna have me try if I And you're gonna ruin me. Oh god. Okay, so if it's Orberg. If it's Orberg, hopefully this guy's a rock type gym leader, so I'll be able just to pile a drive with my grass type and just call it a day. Hopefully, hopefully. Just grab both of his ears and start kicking. I was gonna say grab his little legs. Or no, 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 like as it's flapping, you grab one ring and then grab his leg. Granted, I don't know. Okay, here's a weird thought. Here's a weird thought for everyone. You know, obviously the average person isn't gonna be one to like get into a fist fight with an animal to the point where this question could be asked. But you have to kick the shit out of this animal enough so that you can catch it and not kill it. Because of how strong I know Pokemon are, I don't I don't know how much force to apply. <laughs> Cause like I just suggested grabbing a Zubat and slamming it into the ground. It's like would that kill it? I mean, it's a Pokemon. So they're like insanely strong, but I don't wanna kill it. Like shit. How'd I do that? 
Oh, hey, wait, it's you. You look different. Okay, stand back and watch this shit. Using the hidden move for rock smash, get rid of this boulder block in your way. Fallen boulders need to be smashed, they're out of the way. If you get the badge from the gym in town, you'll be able to do this too. Of course, you have to beat the gym leader first. That'd be me! Get your ass back here. Get your ass back here. Oh, shit. This is my chops coming. This is my chops throwing hands. Okay, never mind. We're good. Get your ass back. Get your ass back here. Get your ass back here. Here's what we're going to do. All right? here's, here's the order of operations. All right, step one. Kick the shit out of that gym leader. Step two. Skip as many people as possible. And we start catching all the Pokemon. Step three. Catch a hair across and catch everyone else we're gonna need in the process. Step four. Ruler. And um, we'll we'll go back and we'll like talk to all these people too and be like, alright, who wants to battle? Because like those little kids being like, hey, do you want to battle? I don't remember that being a thing, so we could we could talk to all those people and be like, hey, who wants to fight? Who's gonna give me an item? Who's gonna give me a challenge? Da da da. And then we'll be all fine. I stretch my leg. Alright. Hopefully he's a rock type. Hopefully he doesn't throw any curveballs. Let's fucking go. Yeah. You could skip the fights too. Nah, I'm not gonna skip the fights because we need the experience and once I beat the gym leader, he, we're, those fights will be unavailable. So, we, we will stick through these fights. Redress, hello! But it, yeah, exactly. That that is a perfectly that's a perfectly valid question. I'm like, okay, so she's psychic and she can like screw with people's minds. What's that on a power scale versus a Pokemon? And like, okay, all humans. I mean I think like the, the classic question classic question comes up of, okay, so I'm a human, right? And I punch a Pokemon, right? Was that a fighting type move? Or is it imbued with a certain magical energy or certain skill kind of a deal? Or is it a normal type move? As a human, am I a normal type? Or am I a fighting type? Because I'm capable of fighting, fighting type actions, but that doesn't mean I specialize in it. If I fight it, does that make it a dark type, or is it dark because it holds, like, dirty tactics and innate evil energy? And I, I, I recognize there's no good way to address these questions, but these are questions I feel like everyone who plays Pokemon wonders about. We are absolutely cheating the shit out of this gym, and that's okay. At this point in time, oh shit. Ah! Ah, that's fucking huge! Oh, no, wait, wait. Uh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Hold on, hold on. It's been good. Yeah, we've just been talking silly, and I realized um, getting bug Pokemon's a little harder than I thought it would be in this game. Turns out there's only one you get organically, and that's Krikatot. Wait, what? That Dying Light 2 was specifically because of COVID? Jeez. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, uh, okay, so 55.95 versus 40. Uh, it's better than Lethal Chamber. Let's see. Well, there's Ash, Curl, the mall who can hold a 2K color in his head like the feathers from the streets are like, going on there. Oh, that's right. Is it? Isn't that the Larvitar? That like they have him like holding a Larvitar or something like that, and they're like freaking huge. All right, and I recognize I'm not hurt that much, but I'm gonna top off a little bit. Uh, it's one hit point. We're good. Set, bitch. Welcome. This is the Orberg Pokemon Gym. Give me my fucking rocks. I'm but with one trainer who decided to walk proudly with Rock type Pokemon. As a gym leader, I need to see your potential as a trainer, and I need to see the toughness of the Pokemon that battle with you. 
Better not do some bullshit like only use a grass type Pokemon that knows one move. You better not. If you do that, I'm gonna get pissy. First Pokemon, Zubat. If you use a water gun on Onyx followed by a Taser, what would that be considered? Pikachu is similar with the Fire Springs of Rock Ship, man, man, it's super effective. Yeah, but that's anime logic, like. You know, because Pokemon would just be like, oh, water type, that's effective. Uh, electric type wouldn't be effective, but. Why are ground types unaffected if they're organic? You know, just the the fun, endless, trying to apply real world logic to Pokemon. But do you think you could? Okay, that, that was a question we had earlier. That was a question we had earlier, Rodris. If, um, it went back to Twitter. Yeah, fair enough. But, um, that was a question we had earlier of, do you think you could fist fight Pokemon in real life? And think you could take down the next Pokemon like you did the other ones using the same move repeatedly? I say to that, yeah, probably. Oh shit! Fuck out! You have like zero defense. Oh god, you're alive! No way! Not yet! Not giving up! Nerd. Ah, oh, you pe. Oh, you scum lord. You scum lord. I totally did that five minutes ago, but it doesn't count. It doesn't count. Right. Oh, sorry. Just repositioning again. What? What? That can't be. My buffed up Pokemon. Give me your 20 bucks. Give me the rock smash. I'm leaving. Oh shit. Oh shit. You received the cold badge from Rourke? Best believe I'm bum rushing this shit. Oh! Heck no! Oh god! Like, uh, okay, a Geodude? I think I could take a Geodude. Rhydon and Kangaskhan? Fuck that! Oh god, no! Ugh! Oh shit. God, a Rhydon would freaking murder me. No. Oh my goodness. I don't give a shit about stickers. Alright, bye. Bye, bitch. Bye, Samus. Alright. Um, okay, so now we can heal. Now we can heal and, um,. Like Onyx, Rhyhorn, Larvitar was a good example earlier. Nino King would just break you on the spot, just fucking break you. <laughs> but like, Machop? Maybe? Except, isn't it in their Pokedexes that like Machops can like lift every boulder known to man and like know every martial art even though they were just born you got the gym badge huh it thought city is the next place with a gym that gives away badges all right so yeah i went through route 207 but you can't go through it without a bike i made my team battle and toughen them up so it wasn't a waste i'm going back to gym life city next stop the eternal gym badge goodbye bye freaking loser Let's see it's called dodge to a side jab 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 dodge jab 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 you're a punch of rock <gasps> shit uh, I was trying to you saw I was trying to evade that the moment I saw it, I was like wait yeah. But it did not work You punch a rock or you have to like go up and go like that, No, it'd be like pop <laughs> Jill hair couldn't stay up to a site there that episode. I think she raged so hard. She was mean luck without no <laughs> That's pretty fine But um I don't know Dude, every time I play Pokemon these are the questions that come to my mind. Which Pokemon could I probably take in a fight? Like a legit mono y mono fight. And then like all sorts of other questions come up with. Okay, a gun is the obvious answer. Or a knife. 
I can work on that. I can play this game. You could probably handle Metapod as long as it doesn't use Harden too much. It, it uses Harden like 15 times. It's not a matter of it hurting me so much. It's like I'm just throwing it against the environment and being like, fucking die. And then eventually I'm like, well, shit, I'm going to drown this bitch. See what it does against that. <laughs> just hold it. Like, string shot is shooting out of it. Like, um, whatever those cans are. That, um, you know the silly string cans? I'm just, like, holding its head underwater. <laughs> Hairspray to lighter man. <laughs> See, okay, I want you to know, you're totally correct in saying that. But I'm picturing, like... You picked me up right now. Okay, so I can't show you, but I'm not wearing socks. I'm not wearing shoes. It, I, I have nothing in my pockets. Actually, wait, hold on. What, what, what do I have in my pockets? Hold on, hold on. Nothing. I have nothing. Oh, wait, I have my wallet, and that's it. So, therefore, I can use um, uh, Payday. See how that works out. But, um... Yeah, I'm assuming no weapons, not like you might as well throw me into the arena naked. The clothes are just for everyone's like viewing benefit. Alright, who could you win against? Yeah, Meowth gets distracted by my crisp one dollar bill. He just... <laughs> okay, we gotta avoid. Clean. Clean. Alright, it is one minute to eight, so soon there's gonna be like a 10% chance for a cricket tat. So, it's pretty good. Get there. Shinx is great, don't get me wrong. There's a lot to like about Shinx, but we don't give a shit. We just, we just don't. Like, ah, damn it! <gasps> it just became nighttime. It's blue. Don't point that out. It's blue. WD -da -da. There we go. So yeah, now we're. I'm willing to bet in trying to get the, um, in trying to get the other bugs, we'll run into a frickin' tot. But yeah. Uh. Wouldn't bend the mammalians or birds since they have teeth bigger than your hand half the time. See, I was gonna say, like, I feel like a lot of the mammals. Well, no, it depends on the mammal. Like, for example, Shinx. Uh, Shinx got the electricity, so that already makes it a little iffy. Oh, shit. They're so cute, I can't take them seriously. These miscreants are babbling out of nonsense that I just can't stomach. Something about. Uh, the rise of the people down with the bourgeoisie. Take care of them. Show them some manners, if you will. Oh, Professor, must you be so difficult? We are pro uh, all you must do is provide us with all your research findings. In return, we'll see to that your assistant doesn't become collateral damage. Abutharita, let's battle together and teach those losers a lesson. Lucas, back up. You see, if anything, I, th I think the birds would be kind of tough. Unless it's hard headedness and smash. <laughs> but, um. See the. Oh my goodness, he's got a worm ball! You bastard! I want a worm ball! You piece of. Hey! Don't steal my kill! Back the fuck up! But, um. What was I gonna say? No, Jigglypuff would be hard because is a Jigglypuff like a marshmallow? Or like a balloon? Almost kind of a deal. So like, because okay, all I can do is physical damage, right? All I can do is punch or bite it. Maybe if I like grab the flesh and like, kind of a deal, I could hurt it. But even then, that's, that's debatable. But like, um, see, birds. I think once I had them in my hand, I could. I you don't know, just bird. But like. Until then, it's gonna do like drive-bys, and that's gonna be really hard. Yeah, that's true too. I mean, that that just kind of depends on like, what does psychic damage do to a person? You know what I mean? 
If you leave us no option, we will retreat for now because Team Galactic is benevolent to all. We shall leave. You have to worry about any lo lobby birds that know Ember. <laughs> oh, what is that? Um, That one firebird from Hawaii. I forget. Gen whatever. That is just like out of nowhere. Ember! <laughs> So they call themselves Team Galactic, do they? When Pokemon evolve, they seem to release some sort of energy. I believe it's a mystic power far beyond our control, but Team Galactic seems to be trying to harness that power for something. That's why they all use bugs, because they evolve all the time. Unless you have to, the Pokemon that are harder to evolve, release more energy. Anyways, Abathrita, well done. You battle quite capably. Seeing you trainers battle side by side with your Pokemon only makes me more confident in my decision to trust you with the Pokedex. Abathrita, did you know that every... The... Whatever. Fucking. Oh my. Wait. Samus? You're not Samus. Those guys looked awfully scary, but you sure showed them. Anyways, my name is Bibi, and I work as a system administrator in a hard home city east of here. Now, thanks for putting on such a good show, I'll let you access Pokemon boxes from anywhere. Whoa. The capsule decoration feature. What? Fucking shows, I don't give a shit. Okay, so we gotta once again avoid. Damn it! Cricket Tot, Cricket Tot, You're not Cricket Tot. You're not, you're not my bird. Sorry, you're not, I'm, I can't talk straight. You're not, you're not who I'm looking for. Okay, so... Yes. A wild Bidoof helped out using... What? A wild Bidoof? How the fuck did Bidoof get in here? Oh, that's really good. Really good. But because it's a one-time use thing again, I'm... Mm, I'm hesitant. Talk to me. I'm gonna have to fight you. Let's have a battle while smelling the aroma of flowers. I don't want to talk to you, lady. You're very pretty, but I don't want to talk to you. Okay? Leave me alone. I'm gonna murder your freaking. I'm gonna murder your freaking plant. So, nah, I don't know. I was about to say, so group vote, we are getting rid of Churchwig once I fill up on bugs, right? And get them all properly leveled up. Kind of, oh, fuck. Aren't you snazzy? But, um, I still think we should. I still, I, I don't think it's in the spirit to be, of the challenge to be like, yeah, everyone's a bug except for Churchwig. So we'll like give a good college effort to not use them once we can. You say nay, nay to Turtwig. You say nay, what a wonderful type of day. Where we can all learn and play, to be kind to each other. I don't remember what song is. I'm gonna eat that other berry. See that other berry? It's supposed to be full of, full of nutrients. Oh, you say nay, you say I should keep Turtwig? I should keep Turtwig on the team. Alright, um... I will give an antidote. Alright. Don't worry, bug trainer. I'm gonna become you someday. Your ass is mine. Dude! Nice! Nice, that's gonna be really good. Okay. Sure, it's low level. It's not the strongest thing in the world, but that's okay. 
nay to not using. So yes, you would like me to, you think I should keep Turtwig on the team as my one, well, as my seed bed, as I've decided to call him. Also, like, just me, me imagining in my head. Like, you know, you have Torterra walking around and he's his own little biome. So all the bugs are hanging out on top of him and he walks around. But that's beside the point. All right, we made it into town. We have to figure out who the heck sells the honey. Yes. Uh, oh, that's right, I have to... That's right, I gotta do this mechanic. Yes. There you go, okay. Who the heck sells the honey? Okay, I'm here to buy. Uh, I'm trying to talk to the girl. Okay, maybe if I like, is it a person I can talk to out here? <gasps> See that tree right there? See that tree? That's what I need right there. He works at the Valley Wind Works, but the people dressed like space aliens and me won't let me in. Hey, assholes! I need that tree! Ah, Dicks! Alright, fine. Um... Oh, wait, this is also a honey tree. Don't you dare go to the Valley Windworks. I got orders to keep everyone out if they're not part of Team Galactic. You're gonna be a look that makes you think you're gonna try to get in. Okay, then you have to bow me for it. Uh, Dawes the donut to get to talk to that kid by the tree. And hopefully he gives us an infinite supply of honey. And then we can finally get other Pokemon. That's my goal for this episode. I don't know if you guys know that, or realize that. It's literally just get other Pokemon. That's it. That's all I want out of life. In the process, freaking Turtwig is gonna evolve into a Grovile or whatever it's called. Oh. No, it's. Grovet? Stop. Grovet. Anyways, before we go in, though, if I lock myself in with my works key, oh shit, my cohorts in the flower patch, eh? Wait a second, the flower patch, like the one in town, or like. Or it's in the flower patch. I want Oram berries. The other berries I do not give a shit about. Um. Yeah, I literally do not care about the other berries. I just want, I just want the healing ones. Cohorts in the fl ah. <laughs> Not my new move. Ah. Yep. Okay, so they're they're over there. I was gonna say, is this elderly couple? I'm sorry, what?
need to wipe my nose. Um. 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 I was gonna take a small break. So, uh. We'll be right back. Um, yeah, we're gonna be right back.
Right, I'm back. Sorry about that. I just shoved a whole bunch of videos in my mouth. Holy shit, they gave us a Mew! I'm sorry, I need to see you talk about that for a second. They gave me a Mew! Jeez! I was not expecting that! Oh god! Wow. Enough arguing, hand over that s <gasps> Give me the damn honey! <laughs> Give me the fucking honey! Give me the fucking honey! There are oh, young man, lady, bugs, Zerg. Thank you so much for safe for saving me from those evil gentlemen. They were going to hurt- I don't know what gender they are. They were going to hurt me if you didn't come along. I'd be like, yeah, shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up, old man. You know, what, what, what's the, like, the meme from Megamind where it's like, oh, I wouldn't say you're safe so much as you're under new management. Give me the damn honey. Nothing else matters but me getting that honey. Aw, oh, it's so cute. Oop. Probably knows poison sing though, so. And it has the spikes, but yeah, I'm actually really impressed that they just gave us that they just gave us those Pokemon. Now on on one side, I am totally cool with that because those Pokemon are hard to get. Like, really genuinely hard to get. So having a genuine like, hey, here's Mew. Hey, here's Jirachi, it's like, oh, Yeah, you know, like, yeah. Okay, sometime what I need to do is I need to. Um, there used to be this like Pokemon bank kind of a deal. I need to find that shit and um, rehook it up so I can transfer Pokemon from my old games to it. I'm up next. Hey, hey battle you right after my car is weakened. You gives me the edge. He actually has a point. Uh, he's actually right. I'm gonna need to take at least a turn. Uh, it depends on what I'm fighting. I'm gonna need to take a turn to heal. I might be able to just uh, brute force this bitch, but I'm at half health. I'm probably fine, especially if all he does is use absorb. I'll be fine, probably. I was just thinking he's probably gonna switch like super and stuff like that. I don't want to say it out loud, I was hoping to be stupid and just keep using Absorb. Ah, I was just thinking that if I get, if I hit myself, I'm gonna need to start healing. Alright. There you go. So I give you a free turn, that's unfortunate, but I highly doubt you have a weak attack or a leech life, so. <laughs> Look at that one hit point you healed. I'm so proud of you. I'm so proud of you. Oh, really making it up there in the world, aren't you? Really making it up there, bitch. All right, one more. Side so note, I've known talked about this before. I adore in Pokemon. When they make it so the animations are slower. God damn it. When they make it so the animations are slower when they have low health. I think that's just I think that's really nice. It's a lovely touch. That's just me though. Like I I it's a detail that I love. Damn it. I just want you to know, Grunt. Me hurting myself has done more damage to me than anything you've done. I would just like to share that. Like, I hurt myself more than you ever did. Oh my goodness, he's gonna evolve. He's gonna evolve. Oh my goodness. Guys, let me stunt on you real quick. You wanna see, like, you wanna see what it looks like when Pokemon evolve? Shit. Oh, oh, okay. Must be next level then. This brat's tough. Like, really, really tough. Tougher than I can put into words, and I know a lot of words! We're done for now. Let's get back to the Valley Woodworks.
Oh, it's this thing. They seem to have forgotten it. It's a works key. It must be. Uh, uh, thank you. I'll keep it for my own use. Like, damn it, old man, I need that. You surely saved me. Those goons were trying to rob me of my sweet, sweet honey. They sure were weird, though. You saw how they were dressed. What they were saying didn't make a whole lot of sense either. Oh, dear, thank you. Will you take this as my thanks? How much is it? Is it, like, infinite? Is it infinite, honey? Or is it only, like... Is it, like, you use it once, or... The guy just pulls out a sword. <laughs> so I gotta find a way to say how strong you were. What's up? So, they said I have to come back later? So is it, what, is it not immediate? Oh, don't tell me it's not immediate. Yes. Is there a time limit? So, if you had a guess, right, if you're like, if you're wondering like how long, if you had to guess how long, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, was that my only thing of honey? I'm sorry. I'm fucking sorry. No, I don't want to talk to you. Fuck off. Yes. You have to wait. Okay, so here's here's how the mechanics work. Here's how the mechanics work. Here's how they work because this is a brilliant fucking idea. That breaks my heart. That absolutely breaks my heart. Thank you. You 
you have to wait six hours. You have to, here's the step, here's the step-by-step -step process. You have to have honey, slather the honey, wait for six hours. And if you wait for more than 24 hours, if you wait for more than uh, 24 hours, the honey and the Pokemon go away. I am so unbelievably pissy right now. Do you remember Headbutt? Anyone remember Headbutt? I don't know what Headbutt was. Find your ass a tree. Just, just find, just find your ass a tree. Just find your ass a tree. And slam your head against it. And a Pokemon comes out. Easy peasy repeatable. This shit. This. Oh my goodness. This is depressing as all get out. So I have to wait for six hours. I have to wake up at 2 a.m. 2.30 a.m. to check that. Joke's on them. I'm going to sneak my switch into work. And on, and on lunch break, fucking check that shit. Okay, so here's a problem, right? Here's a problem. I don't want to progress in the game anymore. Because I want those bugs. The only way to get those bugs is through those trees. Uh, I'm going to progress at least enough to get to that tree right there. How about that? Um, that is so stupid. That is... Have I emphasized that point? What the... Oh my, I have to wait six hours. But Max, we want little Jimmy to play the game. Oh my goodness, I have to fight the commander. Is all the experience... Oh, if the commander's just right there. We want little Billy to play this game and to check it multiple times a day because we want them to be addicted so they love Pokemon and they're so excited about seeing all sorts of Pokemon. So they check and they play and they think about their Pokemon all day and all through the night. Meanwhile, grown ass adult 26 year old Max, who has a full time job and has been in the military, Trying to play this game for children on Twitch for the entertainment of others has to wait six fucking hours in order to have a 1% chance of one of his favorite Pokemon. I'm gonna sit here and be pissy about this for a while, okay? Six hours! For a one percent chance. Yes. And yes, Jail, yes. And yes, Jail, what I know. Guess you gotta turn the stream over to the chair. See you at 3 a.m. Basically. First thing I'm gonna do in the morning before work is chuck those damn trees and catch something.
That is so dumb. That is so... I know what they're going for. I get it. They want the time mechanics. I was cool with the certain Pokemon in the morning, certain Pokemon during the day, and certain Pokemon in the evening because it makes it feel more dynamic. And sure, it gets a little annoying because I would have to, like, wait until 8 o'clock to even have a chance to get a uh, fucking... Get through as soon as Max and Tom goes through. Oh, but, um... You know, like, I, uh, Zubat won't show up during the day. And that makes sense, and that's logical. And then you gotta worry about, like, oh, these Pokemon shows up in the morning because of the Tucker Power. And that makes sense. And it's annoying that I have to wait for Crick Todd until, until 8 p.m. But fine, whatever. I can, I, I can accept that emotionally. And yeah, I know, I have a fucking, I have a fucking, it's not called the Jericho, it's called Jirachi. I have a Jirachi in view that I got for free, but that wouldn't be part of the challenge. A little bit. Um, I, I, I like, and if I use the Mew and the Jirachi, it would like be freaking. If I use the Mew and the Jirachi, then that's wasted experience, and it's not part of the challenge. I can get a microphone that looks like an ear and lick it and sell my own bathwater. Suck eggs. I'm mad at you. Fuck you and your weird boob spacer dress. Fuck you. I'm one of Team Galactic's returning, I should say, three commander. We would try to create a new world that's better than this one, you piece of shit. People and assholes show a little understanding about what we do. Uh, you don't understand either, do you? It's a little saddening. It's a battle to decide what we should do next. If I win, you leave. If, <laughs> if I win, I get to kill you. And if you win, you get to kill yourself. So, you know, really, either way, it's like in your favor if you think about it so like we might as well just do this now right it would make the most logical sense right i think it would i think we're pretty understanding in this regard so yeah it's, it's fine i am so pissy i am so unbelievably pissy i'm sorry i should not be this mad i should not be this mad but i am and i'm sorry i don't like being mad but, uh, <laughs> roulette with a <laughs> Whoa, what the fuck was that? What just happened? What was- What just happened? What just happened? That Zubat just died. Oh wait, did you just use U-turn? Okay, fine, I'll drink some water. I'm sorry, I'm mad. I'm allowed to be angry. Damn it. I just realized, what the fuck did we step into a planetarium or whatever? Add Fuck. Oh my gosh. Fuck. Fuck. Damn it. That's unfortunate because it should be set up to should be set up so that even though I can't hear it, the audio input goes to the. Oh no no no, that's the microphone. I can't hear it, but you guys can hear it. Which actually just means I should set it to. Set it to. Hold on. Hold on, I'm still being pissy. Hold on, I'm still pissy. Hold on. Alright, theoretically, you should have been able to hear that. Okay. Good. 
I would love some vodka. I would love some vodka. I'm sorry. This, I know I could sit back and recognize, Max, you're doing this to yourself. You've decided that you will only use bugs in this game for some reason. This game for some reason really doesn't like bugs. Okay, like, that's fine. We can accept that about our current situation. Yes, I am fishing for a critical right now. Zubat's just gonna use U-turn repeatedly because that'd be the smart thing to do. Just Perugly does so much damage because we're the same level. And I have so little attack. And look at that, I got one Razor Leaf in. Fuck you! Fuck you! No way to do this. I'm gonna lose. I have to give this bitch my money. I'm gonna have to give this bitch my money. What if I sit here and just grow a lot? How many times have you used? How many times have you used whatever bullshit? I, mean? I can't run. It's a it's a trainer battle. It, it's it, I can't I can't run. I literally cannot run. It's a trainer battle. I'm gonna sit here and boost the shit out of myself. Yeah, fuck you. Yeah, what if I just do that? What if I just sit here and just boost the shit out of myself? And then it'll be like, oh, now you withdraw. How about that? I can't run. The game won't let me. I don't know what my attack is, but I'm gonna assume it's higher now. Let me do this one more time. Oh my goodness, you could use fake out every time. You could use fake out every time you switch in. What, okay, objectively, if I wasn't so mad right now, that's hilarious. That is funny as shit. It'd be even better if like, for whatever dumb reason, she also, like, this cat also knew, like, bolt switch or U-turn or something like that. So that way it was just, like, this roulette of, um... But no, then I'll have to redo all that other shit. I'll, I'll have to redo all that other shit, then. Alright, so... Alright, so now I'm gonna heal twice. And then I'm going to use withdraw three times. So really, can you imagine like Pokemon with U-turn? Like just take two Pokemon with U-turn and fake out, and just be like, Me -he. switch, Me -he. switch, Me -he. switch. Ah, oh, that'd be so gross. It'd be funny though. It'd be gross. Now we're sitting here for the long haul. I'm mad. I'm mad, so that means everyone has to suffer with me. That's the rule. Yeah, that's that's the rule, guys. I'm sorry, like we're we're all suffering this together, right? This lady wants to be a fucking bitch and stop me from getting towards one more honey tree, so I can like actually sit there and check that shit. We're gonna, we're gonna do it, damn it. Honestly, okay, so here's my plan. Real talk for Gator, here's my actual plan. Um, we're gonna long, we're gonna, we're gonna long con this fight. And cheese the shit out of it. Okay? That's step one. Because we have to, we have to make these potions last. Step two. 
we're gonna do whatever the story bullshit says we have to do to um then we're gonna do whatever the story bullshit says we have to do to get to that next to get to that next tree. We're gonna slide that bitch with playing. Okay? That's step two. Step three. We're gonna stop playing. And we're gonna find a different game to play. Probably dead by daylight. Why can't uh, am I not able to see my own stats anymore? Like if I'm plus or minus or whatever? Like why am I not able to see that? Because I don't know how much I've been like. I don't know how much my Okay, I used growth three times, but I think I've You're pretty tanky though, so. Yeah, we're probably just gonna play a few rounds of DVD. So I can get more stress. Okay, okay, so actually I, I need a vote. I need a vote. Do we play DVD? Or Either DVD or I play Fallout 3 for a little bit. And it would basically be like a little group understanding that I'm playing Fallout 3. And because it's my first time playing it, that you'd be playing it, we'd be playing it without context, with no memory of like what's going on, and we would never come back to it. Ever. We would never ever come back to it. It would just be, I'm gonna play for funsies for an hour or so, and then we call it good. DVD is probably the easier one to do that with. But um, yeah, exactly. So we'll probably just do that with it, right? um. So with Fallout, uh, not maybe like a month ago or so. I forget now. Um, I was like, you know what? I want to sit down and play Fallout. I wanted a game to play on lunch break that I could play on a crappy computer. Yeah, and um, I started playing Fallout 1 and 2, and I really enjoyed them. There's, they're not perfect. They've got some issues, besides it just being an old video game. Like, it, it's not that they're old that makes them, like, objectively bad. Because they're good games. It's just, it's the old game mentality of, we ain't gonna tell you shit. You're just gonna have to figure it out on your own, and it's really easy to miss stuff, and it's really like a lot of things just flat out are not explained to you. And that's a good thing in games sometimes, but also got kind of annoying. So it's one of those things of like you play it, enjoy it, have fun. Don't feel bad if you need to Google things. That kind of a deal. But um, yeah, I was really enjoying it, and then I finally started three, and I've been really enjoying that one as well. Although I will admit, I hate that your car. Okay, so the character I made, I think I talked about her before. Her name. Her name is Mallow Havnow. And she was. I think I talked about her. Uh, I talked about her a little bit. Oh. Be right back. Oh, that's all good. Speaking of, I need to finish Oblivion. Aww. You made those bad people go away. I think the balloon Pokemon will come visiting again. The balloon Pokemon? Um, that's a Drifloon. And those steal children. Uh, little girl? Do not play with the Drifloon. Do not play. Do not play with the... Wait, what? I already slathered it with me. No. I already slathered it. Do not play with the Drifloon, small child. Do not. Okay, there you go. Yes. Okay, so. I'm gonna check something stupid real quick. But, um... Yeah, so Mallow Have Now is basically... Whenever I play any games like um, Skyrim or whatever, Malahav now is the character I make. And her whole gimmick is that she's basically from Dungeons & Dragons, an arcane trickster. That That is her whole shtick. She is an arcane trickster. 
and um, like chaotic good. So she wants to help people. She's a good person, all that stuff. But she pickpockets everyone she sees, and she is a bloody thief and a kleptomaniac to an absurd degree. So high stealth, high dexterity, and then whatever kind of like magic we can teach her, we're going to teach her. And um, I played her in Oblivion, but I stopped playing Oblivion because I got bored, and I, I, it just felt repetitive. I just got, I got sick of it, so I need to go back and do that sometime. But um, yeah, I played her in uh, Fallout One. Uh, basically, my perks were the stuff that made it so you can't do an aim shot, but you can shoot faster. So my goal was to only use pistols. So I got like all the different things for like, you can shoot a pistol the best. I got like basically a hand cannon, which is kind of like going nuts and that was good fun. And then the second one, I was like, okay, let's do something similar. And I did basically the same thing, except I got rid of the fast shots thing. So I made it so I could aim at people, and aim at specific body parts. And then I was like, okay, let's actually use sniper rifle. So I had a sniper rifle. There was a point in time, where, which I thought was hilarious. I had a sniper rifle that used 223 ammo and a pistol that used 223 ammo. And I was like alternating and firing them and then reloading one and then firing the next one and then reloading this one. But it was like this, si this circle and I would only aim for the eyes because I had enough I had enough accuracy that I could just go back up and back. It was pretty great. But um, Fallout 3, I'm doing, very, I'm doing very similarly just because this is the kind of style of character I like to play. So playing the same kind of character in all the games. So she's high dexterity or uh, agility or whatever. She's high agility, high uh, she's high agility, high power, and I'm just focusing on like pickpocketing as many people as possible while still being their friend. It's a good time. It's really enjoying it. Anyways, we're gonna end the stream for Pokemon, cause I'm pissed. Oh, I'm pissed. I am so I'm so pissed. I know it's like haha. Yeah, whatever. You're pissed, Max. Good one. Hee <laughs> hee. Funny streamer, man. No, I'm mad. I'm genuinely mad about this mechanic. Uh, I looked it up on Bulbapedia. Actually, wait, that's a good point. We should make sh we should see if there's other trees. Yeah. Thank you. Though. <gasps> there's one more. Okay. So. Mm. Okay, there's one 205 north. So let's try to sneak our way up there best we can. Ah, shit. Okay, okay, hold on. So we have 205 North, 206. Wait, there's that one by 218, that's right. Okay, um, there's that one. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. Foo. Ooh. Foo. That's a Polito. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Yeah, we should um we should go around and check. I saw the percentage chance things and ugh, I'm not gonna worry too hard about it. Just because my goal my goals are to basically just crank and get them. Alright, so here's what we'll do. We'll get the trees that we can reach right now. And then on my own time, because technically we weren't supposed to start the bug challenge yet. I'll go through and I'll catch all the I'll catch all the Pokemon that I want. So it's gonna be a bunch of Burmese. It's gonna be uh, uh, wait, what? Oh shit! Uh, the facing of the trees. The tree being slathered is also the last tree slathered and the tree is empty. There's a 90% chance that the tree will attract the Pokemon from the same group that was used before. Okay. So I'm like reading it really fast.
Yeah, I agree. Okay, that that's that is a fair suggestion, and thank you for telling me that. I'll I'll make sure to in depth read that. Damn it! If I have a quick time, I'll. I wasn't expecting to show us. Oh, you got me there. I was not expecting to show us. I'm beat to shit. But um, yeah. Since we weren't orig we weren't originally intending on um doing Pokemon today. That's gonna give me plenty of time to sit down and like check the mechanic every six hours. Uh, honey is cheap. Honey is cheap. Worst case scenario, I can go fight a few trainers to get more honey. You know, if I spend all my money on it. And, um, should be able to do that. So that'd be cool. Uh. Like, I get that it's meant to be, you know, it's like dailies in any other video game. They want you to keep coming back, but. The fact that it's like that only for certain Pokemon, and that all the Pokemon in the game are locked to that mechanic, or all the all the bug type Pokemon are locked to that mechanic, except for one. I oh, damn it! I don't want to fight you. Yeah, the fact that like so many Pokemon are locked to that mechanic. I'm oh, sorry. That all like the bugs. All the bugs are locked to that shit, and no one else. It's, it's, it's heartbreaking. It feels, I feel like I'm being slapped because I wanted to play with bugs. And all I can think of is little Jimmy. Little Jimmy is like, man, mommy, daddy, my favorite Pokemon are bugs. I think Beedrill is my waifu and I love it so much. Uh, single player day-to-day -day quests are horrible when a game is 24 hours of play for over. Them. Mommy, Daddy, Butterfree, and Beedrill are my favorite Pokemon. I love them so much. And then it's like, oh, little Jimmy, you love bug types. Great, we have bug types too. You'll never see them. Ah, oh, it is heartbreaking. Yeah, I don't know exactly when we'll come back to Pokemon. It'll just be like my fill-in one for if we need to grind more for Tales of Rise, or if I if I forget to grind Tales of Rise, kind of a deal. It'll be our, it'll be our fill-in. Assuming I get the bugs. If I don't get the bugs, I'm screwed. Especially because Heracross is a 1 to 5% chance. I love the doof sound. A little brrrr, or like I can't, I can't even make the sound, personally, but it's really, it's cute. It's cute as, it's cute as buttons, okay? It's, Flippin' adorable. I adore it so much. Get the fuck out of here. Evolves before we got our first bug. Don't tempt me. Uh. Grottle. Fuck yeah, Grottle. Growl's data will be added to the Pokedex. It lives along water and forests. In the daytime, it leaves the forest to sunbathe the trees on its shell. How freaking adorable. Growl! The new game looks really good. Was watching someone play outside in the battles being on the actual map along some others. I felt it amazing. I felt about Sword and Shield person, but this one seems to me I want to get a console. Yeah, I... The, oh. The little bit I saw of, um... I don't know, in some ways I was sad that, like, the world looked so empty. But other ways, that game looks like really dope. Like it looks really fun. So I def I definitely want to sit down and play it at some point. But um if I had to like list my priorities. Fuck you, dude. I saw that glitch. No, 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 where where is it? Where is it? Eterna Forest. Oh, okay. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? She just want to fight. Uh, yes. Hey, upside, I'll pick all the bears. Such bullshit. <laughs> Such bullshit. Oh, my goodness. 
Oh, I forgot to water the other ones. I forgot. Stop. I forgot to water the other berries. So I, gotta, I gotta do that too. I'm not a happy camper. I am not a happy camper at all. And I'm gonna do my best to keep it lighthearted and comical, but I just want everyone to know. Called it. I just want everyone to know that I'm Captain Pissy. I think we're gonna stand that. Oh, it's in the north! That's what it meant by the north, so I can't even reach it! Not with that. Cut! Yes, I would, I would like to sprinkle. I would like to sprinkle some water. I would love. I would. I would love nothing more in life than to sprinkle some damn water on this mud in the desperate hopes that a squirrel doesn't come and eat my damn plant. Now this does bring a smile to my face. Thanks, Thanos. Appreciate it. I would love nothing more. Also, the mechanic of, like, makes the pokeballs every 24 hours that was bullshit too that was that was bullshit too because you had to wait like freaking 24 hours for one netball and you don't even know if the netball is gonna work and like half the balls he gave you were useless i mean they're cool that you got different ones but that doesn't mean they weren't good take my damn pokemon okay i forgot to update the graphics how do you spell grottle? Turtwig. That's true. God, that would have sucked if he was just like, I didn't show up for a day, man, now, bitch. That would have been miserable. Objectively, it would have been funny. But it would have been funny in hindsight, but I would have been so mad. I would have been so unbelievably mad in the moment, especially as little Jimmy. Little Jimmy Max, just trying to play Pokemon, live his best life. And the game says, no, check back tomorrow. Just like the prom dates that never get, I don't know, I don't know what this is, but. Uh, exactly. Like, I recognize that today's culture and shit is all about like instant gratification. How as a people we need to move away from that and learn like the and learn you know like the, the good the good whatevers of like it's good to be patient and to wait your turn. Not yet. It's good to be patient and to wait your turn. And pa -pa 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 -pa. I get that, but hear me out. It doesn't feel good. Okay, like. Oh, Max, but the anticipation. The anticipation makes the wait all the sweeter. Yeah, it makes me also want to throw the game across the room. I don't want to wait. Okay? I want my bugs. Like, if there's a thing that they were like, it costs five times as many bugs. Or, sorry, it costs five times as much honey. Oh my gosh, there's an... If there's a mechanic that was like... If there was a mechanic that was like, it would cost you five honey, but it's instantaneous, I would do it. Like, straight up, because that's dumb having to wait. It just doesn't feel good. And I think I'm suspecting. I'm getting a suspect. My suspect is growing. My suspect has fully grown. Oh, those are the only three. Those are the only three. I thought there, I thought there was another. That's also on top of that building. I, I thought, I thought, uh, I, I thought that there would be another tree we could do. 
But no, I think it's just the three. Oh my goodness. I'd like to thank everyone for watching. I hope you're enjoying this. I hope you're having fun. I'm sorry for being a sourpuss. I just am. Fuck you. Fuck you, kid. What's your opinion on bug Pokemon? I'm the bug trainer. Not you. Me. I'm the bug trainer. Brandon. I swear. Fuck you and your cricket time. It's a worthless ass Pokemon. It has nothing unique about it, okay? Oh, it's got a little jingle jangle, and that's a sound effect. Isn't it cute? No one gives a shit. Okay? It's a dumb bug. Okay? It's not unique. It's not interesting. All it's got is that sound shit. So do uh, like 15 other bugs, all right? Look at Wurmple. Wurmple's cool. Wurmple's fucking adorable. Wurmple's like, look at his little spiky thing. He's based on like a real thing. And he like evolves in two different directions. And he got this beautiful butterfly with like lovely designs. And then he got this dust socks. It's like this hardcore poison looking motherfucker. Fuck you. Okay, your Cricketot is ass. Get the fuck off my lawn. Am I done? <laughs> the kid just pulls out all the bugs you want and kicks your butt. I was waiting for that. I was completely waiting for that. It'd be as like, I'm sitting here ranting that I can't get bugs. And he's like, oh, you mean these bugs? Oh, what's this in my pocket? Is it a another bug? <gasps> like, I was waiting for it. Oh my goodness. You know what? Fuck it. I'm gonna do something really stupid. I'm gonna I'm gonna do something I've been thinking about doing for a minute. Okay, okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, so here's the first thing I'm gonna do. Here's the first thing I'm gonna do. Okay, This is bullshit. This is bullshit. Yeah. Yeah. I broke it. Okay, good. Hi. Hello. Hello. Yeah, I'll, 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 I'll fix it later. Um, that's a problem. Hold on a second. Hold on. Hold on. There we go. Okay, there we go. Thank you. I just want everyone to know that I appreciate you. And just thank you for being there and being supportive, okay? Like, I recognize just a certain amount of Max is the one creating the performance or whatever, and everyone's enjoying it but i just want you guys to know that you, i enjoy being with you guys as well okay like it, it means a lot to me that you guys are willing to be here and put up with my bullshit because i have a lot of bullshit to put up with and i just want you to, i just want to say thank you i just want to say thank you so as part of you know um, oh, damn it. Where is it? Where, what, where is it? Is it, is it Binding of Kin? Yes, it is. I just want everyone to know that as a part of, there we go. There we go. 
as a part of you guys being here, it, it means a lot to me as well. Okay, just just th thank you. Thank you, everyone, for being here, and I hope you're having fun. Uh, okay, I just got an email from now. Welcome to Dead by Daylight. Getting no honey from me in Dead by Daylight. <laughs> Oh my goodness, I'm, oh my goodness, I'm just gonna, why is Dead by Daylight mobile an option? Why is Dead by Daylight mobile an option if you're playing through a computer? Why would you stream on your phone? Needs a sequel? Oh shit, um... I don't really know if it would. Why would it need? Why would it need a sequel? There you go. Sorry. Um. Yeah. Why? Why would it? Why would it need a sequel? Won't they just add more characters, or do you think it would be like an Overwatch situation where at some point they'd be like, "Freaking stop, please! I'm begging you, stop." I don't know. That's a that's a fair question. I mean. People made the same thing with Overwatch, right? Like pushing for Overwatch 2, but there's there's a good amount of people that were like, "Hey, you don't need to you don't need to make Overwatch 2, just keep adding to Overwatch 1." You know what I mean? So that's a that's a fair question, I'd say, honestly. Ah, fuck that. I, I just bought a killer that I've never played before and that no one ever plays because she's gross. Here it is. It's the twins. I've never played as her. Got perks I don't give a shit about. All right. Here we go. There was a conversation I was having with a friend of mine once. Um, hold on a second. Of, okay, so I was talking to my friend Zach. And um, he's just for context, he's the one that got me into Tales of Rise. And he brought up a really funny idea. And he's like, you know, if I had to, like, if for whatever reason I had to, this is him talking. If I was in charge of balancing a game, like, I was told, hey, this is going to be some kind of, like, online multiplayer, whatever, right? And he's like, how are you going to do ranking systems? He's like, here's what I would do. I would make it 100% random. There would be no matchmaking. Period. All it would do is focus on getting you into the game as fast as possible. And that's it. That's that's all it would be. And I stopped for a second and I looked listened to that and I was like that's a horrible idea. That's a positively dreadful idea. And then I started laughing because I was thinking about it. And it was like, what what would that even be like if just arbitrarily if just arbitrarily it was like, what if there was no matchmaking? What if there was no MMR? What if there was no I guess this one's kinda green. I'll take it. Right, because, like, okay, so it would lead to bad RNG, right? I think everyone, we can all pretty much agree on that. If it was 100% random, you know, you'd be a new player and you could be put up against other new players. Or you'd be a new player and you could be put up against gods. But if it was like that for everyone, then it's fair. It's completely fair. <laughs> Yeah, like, there, there'd be that, and maybe have something that's like, uh... Um, I have no idea what any of these... I don't, I don't even know. God, that's a lot to read. But, um... You know, like, maybe make it so that, like, cheaters are, are forced to play with other cheaters, or something like that. I, I remember hearing about that once, I thought it was funny. But, um... Yeah, maybe make it so that, like, oh, if you report someone, you're less likely to play with... Like, you're basically not gonna play with them, or... 
yeah, like you said, if you play with someone else, make it so you don't play with them again. But just the concept of, like, it's 100% random. I thought was hilarious. It, would it work? Probably not. But it's funny to think about. Alright, so. We never play twins. Let's make her work. Alright. Um... Press and hold the power button to unleash Victor. Swap control between Charlotte and Victor by tapping the ability button. When left on his own, Victor will trigger killer instinct, revealing to Charlotte the outlines of survivors who are walking or running near him. Survivors who can hear Victor's shrieks are susceptible. However, Victor can be crushed by survivors while Charlotte is being controlled. If crushed, Victor will regrow on Charlotte after some time has passed. I think it's like 30 seconds. Um, while controlling Victor, hold the ability button to charge a pounce and tap the attack button to unleash it. Depends on player base, to be honest. I mean, how often are you going to run to the top 500 in a game with 47,000? Exactly. Yeah. If, like, if there's a huge, if there's a huge player base, it theoretically evens itself out, right? So, it could work. <laughs> All right, um, successfully landing a pounce deals damage to the survivor. If the survivor was at full health, Victor will latch on, triggering killer instinct and revealing the location of all nearby survivors. While latched on, the survivor will be afflicted with the broken, oblivious, and incapacitated status effects. They will be unable to enter lockers or leave through the exit gate. The survivor can crush Victor while he's latched onto them by completing the remove action. If Victor misses his pounce, he is momentarily vulnerable and can be crushed by a survivor. If Victor lands on an obstacle taller than himself, he will be destroyed. I would say for the random thing to work, you'd want it to spread out as much as possible. Like, the goal is fairness and being even, so you just have to spread that shit out and hope. Maybe, like, after every game, it shifts you to a different server. Once again, this is me making shit up. But it's fun to think about. Alright, I'm gonna get soured milk. Uh, and then, um... Shh, whatever. Alright, so what with what was just described, what would work probably deadlock and pentimento honestly but i don't have a reason for them to break things so they're probably not going to break things uh fuck it fearmonger sure uh, uh and then we gotta make ourselves pretty gotta make ourselves there you go. Okay, we got we got to be pretty. We got to Uh you know there's only there's only two that I rot. Oh shit. Yeah, exactly. Like it it would have to be Do you see do you see Victor T-pose up there? I saw that shit. I saw that shit. Don't act like I didn't see that shit. Am I getting texted? Okay, never mind. We're fine. Um my phone started vibrating like violently, so it's like, oh god, is someone actually trying to get a hold of me? Alright, uh, and then we're gonna do the present one. Uh, no. We're gonna do the. I'll do the gay pride one, so that way they'll think I'm friendly. And then they'll be like, oh yeah, we'll totally hang out with you. You're all cute and adorable. That's why I kill them. That's why I murder them. They're like, ha, you think I'm supporting the LGBTQ community. I only did it to murder. Sorry, it's terrible. Not a joke for me. Trapper, simp, menu, double, hex, devour, dead ass. And we got at least one flashlight. This is going to be good. But yeah, like maybe like every few games, it would like throw you to a different server. Oh, but Max, then you'd be a laggy because you're not in a server. Well, maybe they'd be like generally, like just to make something up. Like North America will have... 10 servers and like you switched among the North American servers and then like have Asia server and so you can still oh, no! the one time I saw that I went Whoop. but um I don't know like okay it's an interesting concept it doesn't mean it's a good idea but it'd be funny and I would I'd, I would love it if like for a week Overwatch or Dead by Daylight or some other game was like, alright, this is how we're going to do matchmaking for a week and we're going to see if you guys like it, alright? Like, I, I, I think it'd be funny. Not going to lie, I, I think it'd be pretty funny. 
just to just to do that. Just be like, for a week, everyone's got to deal with it. If you don't want to deal with it, don't play this week. <laughs> We're gonna see if y'all fuckers like this or not. And just like the entire internet lights on fire. They're just sitting there like Thanos, like it's all fair. <laughs> or like Two Face, like it's fair. It's even. <laughs> It's about getting what you deserve. <laughs> Sitting here with my knife going like, wait, hold on. I can't even deal with this knife. It's perfectly balanced. Oops, there it goes. <laughs> perfectly balanced. As, oop, as all things should be. <laughs> oh, God. I, oh, God. Just so everyone knows, I suck at this game. I'm not going to be taking it seriously. We're just going to... This is us being silly on purpose, all right? <laughs> ah, I hate it. Oh, I hate it. Oh, I hated that. That felt gross. That felt nasty. Uh, I'll, I'll let you open it. I'll be nice. Because I'm going to open this one. Fan base ends up loving they all, and they know they can't sustain the method. Why didn't you open this? Fine, I'll, I'll, I'll open it. There, how about that? Victor's guarding three whatever's right now. He's just sitting there. Mind his own business. Waiting for his mom to pick him up from soccer practice. There's like no generators up here. Why would I do that? That's wasted time. I'm just gonna open this one too. Fuck it. Why not? What do you think about this little baby Victor? Oh god, I hate looking at him. Great. Alright, well that answers that question, doesn't it? That answers that question. Where are the stairs? Where are the fucking stairs? Oh, I hate this. I hate this. I hate this so much. This is gross. This is so gross. She ran right in front of me and I never even knew. Damn it. Okay, there you go. I got something. I got someone. Victor right now isn't doing shit, just so everyone's aware and on the same page. Victor right now, not doing shit. Ah, shit, I didn't even realize that was there. I'll hit you too, fuck it. Don't think I won't. Why? What is up with my lunge? What the fuck? Ooh, okay. That worked out. I dare someone to try to flashlight me. Now I'm gonna be a dick. Hold on. Where the fuck's Victor? There's nothing to do up here. Now someone's just gonna work on that generator right in front. Wait, what's the point of Victor? Now, ah. Like seriously, what's what's the point of Victor? Like, so do I like? Gotcha. So do I like leave Victor? to his own devices and like use him as like a monitoring system? That's gonna say dead hard you bitch. Oh shit. To use when they got a bit of a lead and the speed is necessary. Is he faster? Okay, so right there, right? Victor has got a lock on someone. Is this good? Is this bad? I don't know. Oh my, 
Why can't I? Come on. Victor, fucking move. Like, if anything... Hold on. Unbind Victor. Unbind Victor. What, can Victor, like, not survive? I don't get this. This is weird. This is so weird. I feel gross. So now I control Charlotte, right? Because they just did that in front of me, and I let them. All right, they bounced. But I can't see the killer instinct. And then I just had to sit there and get kicked in the face? Cause I missed? I don't understand. I know half the joke right now is we're playing twins so I could sit here and hurt myself. Okay, so I lead the chase. I lead the chase. Ah, damn it. So then he doesn't try to kick me. Man, I move fucking fast. But I'm like so far away. I'm like so far away from him and he can still move full speed, right? Wait, he's still being grabbed, so... And why can't I see where he is? Well, you took my son from me. Apparently, you can still work on the generator, even though you took my son from me. He's not my son, he's my brother. Uh, it also hurts him when he pounces. Right, but like... I don't get it. Alright, so I'm gonna be a dick. So what if I leave Victor right here? What if I just leave, what if I just leave Victor right there? Great. Good. She's gonna say that I'm tunneling her, and it's literally just I'm happy to find someone. Oh my goodness, I missed. Well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna nail you. Ah! That would've been dope, right? All right, all right, switch back, switch back, switch back. So fun fact, she didn't leave because she wasn't sure which direction I was going. I don't know about you, but that's pretty funny. She's gonna lead me on a merry chase, and honestly, it's fine. I'm gonna leave Victor up here just to see if I can catch someone and then like pounce on top of them because I think it'll be funny. But this is. This feels gross. That's right, motherfuckers. I mean, <laughs> that's what this feels like. Bitch. <laughs> that's what 
That's what it feels like. This is like a little gremlin. Where'd you go? Yeah, I got one. I got one person. Whoop de doo. Let's see if they come back for him. They probably won't. It'd be smart for them just to leave. All right, let's. Let, all right, hold on, hold on. I heard that. I'm gonna pick this person up because fuck it. They're they are so determined to save their friend. All right, <laughs> I'll let you do it. We're gonna set your friend here. Uh, pick this person's ass up, and if anyone wants to come over and give me another free hook, all right. That's on you. Just gonna set you hit right here, and then we're gonna unbind Victor because it's uh, it's so gross. <laughs> Die. Ah. Uh. Ah, oh, GG. Uh, that. Uh, oh. I. Oh, look at that. Oh yeah, they're, they're full. Whatever. Um, that. That doesn't feel good. That feels disgusting. That is... Nah. That's all you can think about. Just... Nah, hey, I got all the rewards, though. Alright, um... Alright, well, I guess we'll... Pour more points into her. The fuck trying to find out? I guess we'll just... Give it another try. I mean, deadlock is good, so. Alright, um. Oh, I'm one level short, damn it. Um, we'll just get another one of those. Alright, purple. Crushing Victor while he's dormant reveals survivor's aura for six seconds. Uh, whatever. Um, it becomes silent when pounce is fully charged. Eh. Displays the target location of pounce. Sure, fuck it. Help me learn, right? Alright, uh, there's no reason for Pentimento, so I'm not gonna worry about that. Um... Uh... Mm. Monger didn't really do anything for us, I think, so I'm gonna... I didn't really sneak up on anyone. So I'm just gonna get Unrelenting. Just because it's nice and simple and basic. I don't know what I'm doing. I know. Little brown shirt she love. Crimson Wolf King. Okay. Alright, here we go. Here we go. <laughs> Oh, you're playing right now? No. Uh, I'd like to apologize again that, you know, we're not doing an actual game that we were playing on doing. We're just doing Dead by Daylight. I hope everyone had fun. I know I was kind of ranty with Abathrina, but you probably succeed. But I, I I hope I hope everyone had fun and I'm sorry for being such a grouch. I don't <laughs> uh I guess I should in hindsight I should have looked up Brilliant Diamond and I should have looked at it and been like, okay, how do you get the bugs? Because I saw bugs, honey trees, and I stopped the research. I should have read the page and went six hours. Uh 
So, yeah, I, I should have done that, and that's on me. And I'll acknowledge that, and I apologize. I feel like an ass. But it's fine. It's fine. It happens. So, you know, we'll play Dead by Daylight for a bit. Have some fun. I'll sit here and grab this part of my beard because it feels really long for some reason. It feels, like, dense right here. But, um, yeah. And then next time you stream Pokemon, hopefully I'll have all the Pokemon I want. Gonna need a female combi. We're gonna need a. Now we're gonna need a female combi. We're gonna need a Heracross. Bunch of Wurmples, potentially. Depends on how many we can get. We can get one of each. I'm gonna go for my envelope just to. Because if someone else opens it, I think they get stuff too, so. Might as well just go for this first, right? There you go. I'm hearing someone. I think they're over there. Go, go, my brother. Does Victor scare crows? I think he does. I think he does. Yeah, I'm scared. Yeah, ha! Ha! Suck it! Oh! Eat my butt! Oh! And now I can't see her anymore, so there's no point to it, but it's funny! It's funny! Oh shit, he grew back in me. Disgust. Disgusting. Oh my goodness, it actually did something useful. That brings me the joy. Don't worry, I just saw a person. I saw a person over here. That brings me the joy. It really does feel like, though, that I'm just encouraged to, like, just, like, sit on top of people, you know what I mean? I was curious what would happen. I didn't know if that was actually gonna work. I remember seeing an image of that once. Alright, I'm just too. But, um. Just looking for a match. Yeah, the Q Times for Survivor is still pretty bad. Which works for me because I like playing killer. Although there was a friend of mine that um, hasn't played the game before that wanted to play with me, so we were like waiting for cues for that. Rip no BBQ or Shriver. <laughs> yeah. God, I remember when that barbecue when um Wait what? Bitch. I remember when um, I saw barbecue as one of the shrines, I was like, I'm getting that. Yes, thank you. Uh, I could have waited for that person, but oh well. See, now I don't know where you went. I'm just gonna kick your generator, how about that? I'm just gonna walk over and I'm just gonna... There you go. You're welcome. I heard something. And I'm just gonna do this. Run, my child. Run. Find me, pray. <laughs> oh my goodness, it actually killed him. Oh my goodness. Attack! <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, that feels so gross. <laughs> just be like. <laughs> oh, I'm just gonna. They're probably gonna like go over and try to heal that person that I downed. So let's punish that shit. And somewhere around here's Bill, but I'm not gonna worry about that. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna hook you. Oh, look, there's Bill right there. There's Bill right there. He's gonna unhook the one girl. 
And that's fine, honestly. I don't mind. And you're next to the basement, exactly. Come on. I'm bind, I'm bind, I'm bind. Damn it. I was hoping to do that very quickly. So that way I could... Yeah! Sup? Oh, that felt dirty. Oh, that felt gross. That felt disgusting. Oh my goodness, I'm my own trap. I am my own trap. Oh, that felt. This feels like such a dick move. I'm gonna kick this, cause why not? I have no reason not to. Here's the next question. Okay, so what if I unbind Victor and like leave him in a corner right here? Oh, he's, he's too close. There you go. Okay, hold on. There you go. I leave him there. And then I run off. And if I down someone with Victor, I'll know just to come back. Maybe? Ah, damn. Oh, shit. <laughs> it's so gross. Oh, it's so gross. All right, which one of you bastards? Okay. Uh, unless you have decisive strike. Which I'm gonna try to... So even if you had it... So even if you had it, I was gonna try to outspeed it. Oh my goodness, it's so stupid. That, that feels so nasty. I mean that, by the way. That feels gross. <laughs> she just wound her leg back. I didn't go forward. Yeah, I I I clicked control way too soon. I clicked control way too soon. I probably could have um, I probably could have gotten another shot with Victor, but I didn't. <laughs> so stupid. Oh my goodness, it's so dumb. Okay. Okay, and then I'll do this. And then I'll see if we can find someone else. I really don't like that Victor scares birds. Like, it makes sense. It makes sense, but I'm annoyed by it. Sup? That doesn't mean shit to me! I am without mercy! I have to imagine being like, I gave you an item. Why don't you text me back? I gave you an item. Oh, perfect. Oh my 
my goodness. It's like you just dead hearted away. I'm just like watching it like, all right, <laughs> you got a dead heart tight. <laughs> you do that, I guess. Oh, he's shaking his head. He's saying, no, no, no. Oh, you're going to the basement. Oh, my goodness. Oh, 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 shit. Oh, oh, there you go. Right, right back there. Oh, my goodness. That felt nasty. Can I slap? What happens if I slap Victor? Does it do, like, the same thing as the nemesis? Nemesis? Oh, I can't hit Victor. I just control Victor. That's weird. I don't like that. Why would somebody slap that? Alright. Oh. Uh. GG. <laughs> oh my goodness, that was gross. They're probably gonna give me negative points for like, yeah, proximity to hook survivor and stuff like that, but I don't even care. That was funny. Oh god. Dead hard, dead hard, unbreakable. Okay. I'm understanding that. A little bit. A little bit. Uh we'll do one or two more games and we'll call on anything, but um, Oh, that is stupid. Oh, it's locked. Oh, okay. That's fine. That's fine. Releases in one day. That was fine. We'll just find a different one. Um. Actually, perfect. Chase survivors for a total of 120 seconds. Easy peasy. Wait. Cancel, cancel. Because if we ready up, it'll immediately start us in match. All right, so now we have three perks. Look out, world. Uh, that's a, okay, that, that might be good. That might, that might work. It is a nice perk. It is a nice perk. Uh, I don't get coup de gras. I mean, it has, sure it's nice, but it's like super limited ammo. I'm gonna get Thrilling Tremors. Uh, yeah, sure. All right, oh, that'll be good. Throw another one of these bad boys on there. This one, I don't really know if it helped. Kind of feel like it helps. Maybe. Mm -hmm. If I had um, save the best for last, I'd feel better about it. Just that way, you know. <laughs> the <deep> buzz. <laughs> uh, here to burgle or. Tur Okay, um, all right, let's go. Um, okay, so oppression. Actually, fuck it. Let's try oppression. Let's try oppression. Because the idea of that goes off every 120 seconds. And, you know, like, if it hits a random generator, you know, supposedly if someone's working on it, it'll start regressing. But if someone is working on it, maybe it can help me find them. That is realized DMX Uchiha. <laughs> ah, thanks, Sasuke. This is... I don't know how I feel about Charlotte. On one side, this is stupid and disgusting. But that shit I just got away with is pretty funny. Just gonna be completely honest, it was pretty, it was pretty funny. Alright, Max, have fun with the turd burglar. <laughs> I'm gonna head off and probably play something with myself. It was fun chilling, see ya, wait if you're streaming. Yeah, thanks so much for going, Red Wrist. It's always good to have you, man. And, uh, yeah, the plan is Wednesday, we're gonna continue with the Resident Evil 7 DLCs. I think the next one is the, uh, I forget if it's called the End of Zoe or the Rise of Zoe or whatever it is, but we're gonna start hammering those out on Wednesday. But, uh, yeah, thanks so much for coming, man. It was good to have you. Sorry that sorry for being angry and then switching to Dead by Daylight and being a being a Captain Killjoy. I'm sorry. Hopefully, me playing a random character in an attempt to make myself suffer more is somewhat entertaining. Yeah, thank you for coming. I think we'll play, depending on how long they go. 
one, two, at most three matches more because it's 10. So I'm all, it's almost 10 o'clock for me at nine o'clock. I'm burning sleep. So yeah. So I stretch my fingers, which are gnarled and dry. Does anyone else get like, uh, yep, and there's one of my knuckles bleeding. Does anyone else get like painfully dry skin in the winter? Because I do, and it sucks. Sounds good. No worries. Play what you want to stream when you aren't feeling it isn't good for anyone. Have a good one all. Yeah. Nope. My sister must be home with the dogs. Uh, she, I just can't get over how gross she looks. Like, okay, I've talked about this before. I'm not really one to like. I'm not really one to, like, play or not play a certain character solely for, like, fashion. You know what I mean? Ah, damn it. Oh, good dodge. Oh, shit. Didn't see that shit coming. Ah, damn it. You're playing me for a fool. And she's gone. Smarty pants, that was good. Wait, where'd she go? Didn't see that shit coming, did you, girly? Didn't see that shit coming, did you, girly? Okay, so all generators not currently being worked on. I don't know if the... I don't know if that, uh, okay, it does double up, which means I need to get over there. That's to be expected, that's fine. I'm gonna get that envelope real quick just for the blood points. I recognize there's nothing over here. I'm wasting precious time. But that's 10,000 blood points right there, so. I think I saw a person. Good talk. Good job. Good job. They got two generators done though, and I only got two hooks, so not quite the best odds for me. But you know what? That's fine. We're learning. I'm gonna be a dick. Come on. This killer works better when I was being a dick. That makes sense that um I have to be a ways away to I have to be a ways away to unbind. Cause otherwise I could literally puppy dog guard I could literally puppy dog guard people. Good dodge. Hey! If I could wave I would. <laughs> like, hey yo. You really like doing that early. And you know that I'm punishing you for it. Alright, you can be hurt too. 
Ah, man. I'm willing to share the love. All right, Chris, get over here. There we go. All right. I hope everyone appreciates that I like do the, like I lean forward instinctively. I'm probably just gonna go over here. Yeah, you know, it's like the thing of um, you turn your body as you turn the race car controller. It's the same thing. Perfect. I was hoping to see her, but I don't see her. That's the other thing, like... Ah, damn it. That's the other thing that kind of gets me about Victor, in that, like, you see the... You see the whatever marks. You see the whatever marks, and you know someone is, like, relatively nearby. Uh, I didn't think that was going to reach me, but it did. You know, like, someone is... No hit match, nice. She's being a dick. That Cheryl wants to be chased. But um Yeah, it's like, oh, so there there's something there and you know something's there, but you can't find it. Right. But like once you switch, then you're like, alright, so where is it? I don't know. What do you mean you don't know? I don't know. Those were just bullying the. Oh. <laughs> Suck it. Here to burgle your turts. Nanner, nanner. I don't even know if putting you on right here is a good idea. I'm just going to do it because fuck it. I'm not exactly operating with a solid plan in mind. Alright. It was, it was just a casual player like us. I gotcha. Bitch! <laughs> Not gonna lie. Wait, where's my son? Oh, he's dead. He's dead, but I got hit off, so that's something. Say, I saw that. Oh, you almost got me. Yes! Yes! Puppy dog. Puppy dog. Puppy dog. I just got a achievement called Prowler. Don't know what that means. Don't know what that means. Who the matter fire? Who the matter fire? Who kicked my boy? Who kicked my boy? Fine I'll, hit, I'll, fine, I'll hit you too. I don't give a shit. I'm still just gonna walk right over here. Ow! I didn't think that'd be enough. It actually was. Impressive. Oh shit, I missed. I, I missed that point blank. That's a little sad. It's fine. It happens. She wants me to chase her. Not gonna do it. I'm gonna just let her sit there and waste her time. Uh. 
kind of wish that switch back and forth could be a little faster. Hey, look! <laughs> the kick is so fast, the pound's too slow, yeah. And there I go. Yeah, I know, you'll unhook her. You'll... But guess what? I still got you, so haha. <laughs> And right there you go. Oh, come on, come on. Come on, girlie, let's play a game. Okay, and... Oh, I could have, oh, that would have been funnier. Hold on, we'll see if we can catch her. We'll see if we can catch her. There you go. I was thinking, like, what if I, like, put myself in front of one door and then sent in Victor? I don't know how well that would work. I have to try it sometime. Oh, I don't like this. There right, we go. Alright, so unbind Victor, unbind Victor, unbind Victor. I don't like that Victor takes so long. Oh, hi! <laughs> Damn it. Good jump. Alright. Yeah, they're out. They're 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 out. But I got my six. I feel good. Yeah, the problem is though, now I gotta run over there. So really if I had any perks that like help my movement speed. Up oh, and she kicked him off, so they're all leaving. Goodbye. Let's see if she's hiding around here. Nope, nope. So I realize I get quiet when I play those games because I focus. But does the donuts? She's probably going over to the other one. So, whatever, it's fine. No worries. Yeah, twins. I really okay. Whatever. Fuck you. Have fun over there. You want to sit there? And you want me to try to validate your existence? You go for it. I don't see reasons to. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna go break stuff. Right, uh, I thought I saw something. But um, who's gonna call it? This is weird. It's a weird kind of logic. You know what I mean? Try last second pounce and make him crawl. Uh, no, see, the problem is I can't recall Victor to me. That's the other thing. Once I leave Victor somewhere, his ass is stuck there. Okay, she's left. 
his ass is stuck there. If there's a way that I could be like, hit a button and he like goes down and then comes back to me, that'd be really helpful too, but I don't, so. I probably got this next week. Yep, there we go. Gee. Alright, uh, got Chaser. Yep, 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 yep. I think Xana was the, Xana was the, uh, Cheryl. She wanted, j she just wanted to be chased. Now, what was up with the thing that made it so that none of them had, oh, maybe it was flip-flop? Flip-flop is kind of my counter. They both have flip-flop. Oh, wait, hold on, hold on. Unbreakable, flip-flop, and tenacity. God, that is funny. That is a funny combo. Of like, you regenerate faster, you can move while regenerating, and if you're on the ground, uh, and if you get picked up, you get at least 50. That is funny. It's a mean combo, but, ah, uh, it's good. Alright, uh, let's go turn that in, then let's do one more game, we'll call it. Ah, god, my finger hurts. Oh, you can see this? Yeah, you can't really see it on the camera, but it's, like, all split and broken and stuff. I'm, like, putting a shit ton of lotion on it. doesn't matter. Um, da -da -da -da. There we go. All right, next one. Damage 12 generators. Easy peasy. Surviving team match? Um, nah, because it'll only be one round and we have to wait a while. I'll, I'll, just, I'll just stick with twins, but I appreciate the offer, though, man. Yeah, let's just throw some more perks in, see if we can get to 15. We're probably not going to be able to get to 15, but it's fine. Uh? Yeah, we're not. We're in, uh, maybe. Maybe if I do the math right in my head, which I am not right now. Nope. Almost, but no. Alright, uh, I'm gonna get this. I'm gonna get rid of that. Uh, decreases Charlotte's waking time by 0.5 seconds? Yeah, let's try that. And then let's see the... Uh, what do you want to call it? I love that T-pose every time. Alright, hold on. Um, okay, so I think Deadlock, Oppression, and Thrilling Tremors. I think that was an interesting combo. It was just like constantly hit the generators. I want Pentimento because I really love Pentimento conceptually, but I don't have a reason to make them break. Like I feel like Pentimento really primarily works if you, a you have a lot of hexes and b you um, have that one perk that makes it so like the first time you hook someone like a totem pops up and then they have to go and do it. Like I think that's a funny combo, but yeah, it doesn't really work very well in this situation because right now I, I basically just be hoping that they would break a totem and they would have zero reason to oh great two of them have flashlights what happens if they blind me while I'm destroying this game okay. yep two of them have flashlights so lovely here we go Stretch my arm. Stretch my arm. Alright. This should drive me nuts. Alright. I just realized I'm gonna have to write a list of names. Yeah, I'm gonna have to write a list of names for um Huge McCalla. For the new Pokemon. Cause or unless I can like rename them really quickly, kind of a deal. I actually didn't check that, so sorry. So I'll look into that. <laughs> Alright, Victor, let's go. I bet that one. <laughs> ah, damn it. <laughs> ah, double damn it. Where 
Digga. Ah, mein Gönnis, da war's denn. He just ran. There he is. Where's the entrance? What the fuck? This thing I don't get about this map. Good to know! Say so generator's been done, I haven't even done anything. Alright, this one was considered the most and it's not even been worked on, so they all they they all tag teamed, got it. Alright, come on. God, this little bastard is so weird. Alright. Gotcha, bitch! Down there, got it. Say so that's what you get for being a shitter. Right. Okay. Oh, shit. Damn it! They got two generators done. They got two generators done. I just got one done. I'm gonna leave you there, Victor. Fuck it. Yeah, I am not doing so hot. Right, which one's still... Oh, okay. Yeah, they're totally. They're totally all working together, just one gen by one gen. Come on, Ash, let's play. It's also interesting how there's like a it feels like there's a mechanic of like your goal is to spread out the pain. You know what I mean? Gotcha. It's weird, I thought I saw something. Um is that my weapon? Oh, I hate this. I, okay, good, good, good. I've, I've done that before where I've just gotten like stuck inside one of those things. Makes me feel like a huge idiot. And I'm just gonna... Let's go. Let's see what we can find. So is that yours? I think that was yours. Alright, let's see if you're dead hard. 
or uh, decisive. You did not. So right back on for you. Jeez, three hooks, three gens. I feel like I could do better in life. There you go. Ah, damn it. I hate this underground thing. I hate that I have to play in it. Wow, that worked out really well. That worked out super well. Damn it. No, don't make me play in there. God, do not make me play in here. I hate playing in here. So, I guess that's the spot of base it could be. Just gonna walk out. There's a spot right here to walk out. Thank you. There you go. Alright. Gonna kick this to pop off the one ability. Got three different things are regressing. I really like that ability conceptually. See if you can catch someone. Oh, that is so cruel. That is so cruel. Thanks, Victor. All right, let's see if you have decisive. You don't? Alright. There you go. Alright, found a target. It's that one. So first we gotta find our way up. God, I really look at this Victor. Someone's there. Bitch. Good to know that your mark goes away when you're quiet. It's interesting. Oh, look, it's right there. Let me just kick. Kick. There you go. Victor is still, no one's kicked him yet, impressive. That's my first instinct, every time it's like, someone's gonna kick him, right? Yeah, so I'm just gonna, there you go, I'm gonna kind of body block that a little bit. That's another weird thought process, like, putting myself in such a way so that either I'm hidden or that I'm body high. Stop. Or that I'm body blocking. Sup? Okay, everyone's feeling it. Alright. Uh. Alright, let's see what we can figure out too. Ah! Didn't know if I could, like, get over it. Yeah! Taking that W. Alright, and since he is our own little alarm system... Did you just barely crawl out of his range? You did. You barely crawled out of his range. Smarty pants. Alright, um... 
Okay, someone set up a boon again. That's fine. It's fine. That's fine. I'm gonna body block right here. How about that? Nah, I can't do that. Right, body block. I can't body block anyway. Alright, we're just gonna... I gotta go around. I gotta go around. Go around. Gotta find someone. Gotta find someone. Probably gonna go over there. <laughs> yep. Damn it. Yeah, set play on. <laughs> That's fine. Making Leon's life miserable and. Throwing out some more damage is always good. Alright, now we... I'm gonna send him out. Boom! God, that feels good. And then... Then I'll just casually on the way kick this. I can't kick that. Now I'll just casually walk over. Excuse me. Aren't you so clever? Alright. Uh nearest hook right there. No one's hurt, which is I I actually now that I think about it, what's that um the nurse perk, the one that makes it so that like everything's slower and more frustrating? We're just gonna leave Victor, actually. Everything's like slow. Everything's like slower when you, um. When like people are hurt. Boom. I got one, come on. I'm gonna go put you on a hook. Someone else nearby? Say, so who the heck else is nearby? Like, I hear a generator being worked on. It's this one. Hello. There you go. I'm actually gonna let you run. That's the weird thing. You, you, you didn't think. Oh. Ah, damn it. Yep, there he goes. Yep, okay, let's see. They didn't see that shit coming, did ya? See if we can nail Leon to. I'm willing to bet we're not gonna be able to. <laughs> it's like, <"Whoa." laughs> you just I'm sorry, did you, did, 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 did you just? Oh, come on, come on, come on. Deer Stalker, I feel like, would be really useful for, um. Yeah, I feel like Deer Stalker would be really useful for, for Charlotte, or the twins in general. Because, um. I go down to the basement, let's it. I'm only gonna hear one heartbeat, so if I hear a second heartbeat. I know someone's coming to his rescue. And hey, you know what? If Justin gets away, alright. He's probably opening the gates right now. Which is honestly a pretty reasonable thing to do. Thank you. I'm just gonna bring you down to the basement. 
You are pretty far away though, so I'm a little concerned. Ah! So close. So unbelievably close. He might get away. He might legit get away. I just hit myself. Ah, okay, I thought that would work. So you're really, really going to sit there and do that endlessly, aren't you? Okay, I know one of those gates is just about open, one isn't, so we're probably going to have to escort him out. Maybe not. We might be able to get all four. See, and if I had to make a bet... Oh my goodness, that is cruel. That is unbelievably cruel from across the map. From across the map. I can hear the hatches over there, so haha. -ha. See, from across the map, leaving Victor there. Maybe it's a good thing that, like. Hey, man. Say, unless you have unbreakable right now. Nope, into the basement you go. All right, but um, I I don't know if I'm gonna say twins is like my new favorite, but I'm starting to understand the bullshit. There's a lot of bullshit going on with her, and I kind of like it. I kind of like it, but I don't know if I like it. It's... I'm conflicted. Uh, you said a thing. I want to see what it says. GG. That was a nearly perfect game. Nice. But, um, let's see. When I feel like I 99% of gate, then I, then I was going to heal it down, and then the one... That, the one I had hooked on Node and I opened door went by guy. Yeah, I don't blame you for that. I don't blame you for that whatsoever. The moment I see Noed, I'm just like, nope, I'm done. I'm I am I am playing this game. I'm I'm leaving. Good goodbye. <laughs> but Max, it's all about saving your friends. Nope. Nope. Dunzo. Bye bye. <laughs> I'm not one to play that game. It was also against Pig. Even more so. Well, I guess you can't put a she can't put a thing on you, so just that. But um, nah. Moment I see no at him out, just not playing that game. I right, I think that's all the points I'll. I think that's all the points I'll plug into her. Could put points in other people or just hang on to them for now. All right. So anyways, let's end the episode off here. Once again, I'd like to apologize for being all uh, for being all angry, and then um. I want to apologize for being all angry and not doing my proper due diligence and research. Shit happens. What are you going to do? And, um, the person she died, she apparently picked up and they wiggled free and then died to the... Oh, that's sad. But fitting for the pig. But, um, yeah, I'd like to apologize. I didn't do my due research, didn't set it up right, didn't, you know, all those things. Got mad and we switched to Dead by Daylight. But one of those things uh next time we stream is gonna be on wednesday we're gonna be back to resident evil 7 and then hopefully by then i will have grinded a bit or gotten the pokemon that i wanted and we'll be back to either tales of rise or brilliant bugs uh diamond bugs star platinum uh not switch to our facebook twitter probably discord because i suck at social media but no 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 
Father, so we play you two relatively quickly. The last two, where we played um, Resident Evil and I played with Megan, are also on YouTube right now. And, um, yeah. Let's end the episode off here. Jay Wood, thank you for hanging out. It's always good to have you. And um, everyone else watching, thank you so much for watching. I hope you all have fun. I know I did. And I will see you then. I am I just realized how hungry I am, and it's 1030. I need food. I need to go to bed. <laughs> yeah, thank you all for coming.